Alright, there we go. Hello everyone, my name is Civics. Uh, today we're continuing our stream of Imperial Rome. And uh, it, it's, been, uh, it's been a blast so far. Uh, for those of you, well, it's not yet up online on YouTube, but my last stream uh, I had some issues where for three and a half hours I had a menu screen on here. And you can actually see and hear me doing everything and uh, it was clear that I was playing, but all you could see on the screen was the menu. It was awful. Another one or two hours. Oh, Blind Blitz 2. Sleep is for the weak. <laughs> um, so anyway, I, I thought I'd begin the stream with just kind of showing off a little bit of everything. Uh, not too much detail, but just kind of going over what happened in the last stream. Uh, so I had basically uh, a big war of Carthage. I believe I took Iberia in a previous stream. Uh, this one I took a bunch of his coastline uh, over here and over here. Uh, and then the second war I fought him, which would have been the 10th Punic War, I believe. I made him release his vassals, took a bunch more of his territory. And then the third and final war uh, was actually me just eliminating him. Uh, I took his vassals, his former vassals, in uh, a short little war in between there and finished off these guys and finished off these guys over here. So now I have all of Africa. All of whatever's colonized in Africa. Which is great. <laughs> uh, beyond that, I went and uh, puppeted these guys. Made them my client state. And that was kind of uh, in preparation because I'd rather have them on my side fighting Macedon than have Macedon go and invade him without me. Without my involvement. And then uh, that was pretty much it. That's pretty much all I did in six hours of streaming. <laughs> I, uh, I've been trying to get our government to be. Uh, what is it? To become a dictatorship trying so very hard to be a dictatorship and it just has not worked out very well for me at all so I think what we might do is we might go after this at some point instead the divine sanction and uh, we can be a religious Rome instead of a dictatorship Rome I think that's just what we're gonna have to do because uh, this is like a no-go all my tyranny 55 tyranny and it's not enough you gotta be uh you gotta get these losers into power and these losers just are not that great i think the only way i can really do it is if i turn all of my people all of the popular people into generals fight a bunch of wars with those generals when they're young and then move them into like offices and then i might stand a chance at getting that up to 70 but uh, that's a lot of work so I think we're uh, we're gonna go divine we'll be some religious crazy people because why not it's a good way to it's a historical game we might as well go all nuts and crazy uh, but I do need a particular law to do that uh, what was it? Divinity Statue Law. And I couldn't find it on here last time. At least I didn't see it. Divinity Statue. Divinity Statue. Yeah, I don't see it on here. I don't see Divinity Statue Law. Oh, I wonder if it was a technology that I missed. Hold on. We're gonna Google this. Let's Google this. Can't switch away to Republic to do the leadership to Empire.
Okay, well, maybe we won't do that in this stream, because uh, I don't want to spend the next half an hour researching it on stream. <laughs> so that'll be next time then. This time we're focused on war, and conquest, and glory for the Roman, Roman Republic. Ugh, that word. I definitely gotta fix that word at some point. You started as Egypt. Blind Blitz, you started as Egypt. Uh, well, yeah, Egypt's apparently in a war right now, actually. With Antigone. 95 troops. Uh, oh yeah, looks like Antigone's probably gonna take it. He's already taken over a bunch of the territory, and he does have more troops. Although, what is the manpower? He needs 13,000 to re recover, and he needs 4,000 to recover. Eh, no, you know what? It could still be close. You never know. Although that does not look good. <laughs> Where's Egypt? Did Egypt conquer anything? Nope. Egypt has conquered these two states. And by his fort. So Blind Blitz, I would say your game is going about as well. Your Egypt game is going about as well as Egypt in my game. Just probably. Although Egypt did win these wars early on. They did take all of this from the end point. So really, it's possible they could come back. I think last time... How's their money? I think they hire mercenaries sometimes if they have a lot of money. Uh, but I think Antigone is going to have them beat on that <laughs> as well. <laughs> 3,000 gold and he's got 200. So that might not be possible. Got a military tradition. Good timing. Not getting absolutely fucked by <laughs> It's true. Um, Omenia is sometimes a good choice if you want to play up here against him. Uh, anything in here, yeah, no, anything in here basically starts as a puppet of somebody else. And up here, I mean, you can sometimes. He's doing okay for some reason. Lost a bunch of territory in place, but yeah, it's, it's, I don't know. It's hard. It's not a good area to start off in. Because you're just trapped between some of the big empires. There is massive on. It's not good. Alright, military tradition. Let's get a heavy infantry in defense. Working our way towards Rome Ascendant. And uh, I'm missing a governor. That's always, always good to miss a governor. Uh, so I'm going to. Who do we want? Probably put a family in charge. Um, you know what? We don't need to. Oh, we kind of do. We. I want somebody good though. Yeah, we want somebody who's not a part of our party be in government down here. That is the trick. Because he... He's got a big power base, but he's going to take a minus 100% hit for his power base in the Senate. And since he's not a member of our party, we don't want him to have a power base. We don't want him to have any influence in the Senate. So that... Yeah, okay. I'm seeing now. The blind is seeing. Right, armies. I kind of I debated last time if I wanted to go to war. Since they're at war, I could go to war with them and wreak some havoc and cause some damage. And I think that's what I wanted to do. Except I have no Kazi Bell anywhere against any of them. Well, that's garbage. I believe I started some. 79. Ooh. 79%. Okay, we'll wait for it. Let's uh, spread our armies out a little bit here. Rome shall march north. And we gotta get some of these popular people in charge of our armies. In charge of our good armies that are gonna go and attack stuff. 
but they're kind of a mix mash of troops these days. Oh, and I have a thousand gold. Why do I have a thousand gold? Was I saving up? Oh, yeah, I was saving up for that. Yeah, definitely saving up for something here. Can ban witchcraft and get more food. Because, you know, those damn witches take so much food. Uh, we can get loyal to your generals up. And, uh, yeah, that's kind of it. Um, movement speed is good, but those two take the cake. Alright, who do we got? We got popular, popular, not popular, not popular, definitely not popular. Okay, these three gotta get changed. He's the console of Rome. Well, then he's not important. Uh, he can uh, be replaced by apparently this guy. Wow, there's two of them. Okay. These fabby family people, apparently. I want to be here with us. And uh, we're taking some hit. I hope this is the only scoring family. And it was not. Claudie family. That's not a problem. That's not a problem, because we... Oh, that helped a little bit. Because we don't really need all these losers up here. Especially like this guy and this guy. What are these guys doing? They're doing nothing. Uh, you're supposed to be the doctor guy, and you... I can't remember what you do, and you... I don't know what you do. Oh. Well now. I mean, I guess he's better than this guy's family, though. Alright, what can we place down here? Yeah, that guy's family. You know what? That works. What does that give me? Oh, Freeman happiness. Well, yeah, that is definitely better than having nothing. I should really figure out what this guy does now. No, let's, let's put this youngster in charge. Oh, aggressive expansion change. Wow, now that is useful. That is very useful. Uh, it needs a small olive branch. Low score cost. <gasps> no! I don't want the low score cost to go up. That is the opposite of what I wanted. That is my mistake. Very bad mistake indeed. Alright. Oh! And we have more stuff. Uh, let's get this damn mission. Mission accomplished gone here. Uh, up to 15 pops are assimilated. I like the idea of that. Uh, and you. Do 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 do. Corsica. What is this? It's over here. And they're going to give us tax and happiness for 240 months. I like that idea. And you. Is that a permanent bonus? Doesn't have a time limit on it. I like the looks of that. I like the looks of that. That's until the end of the game. Nice. Nice. I mean, they're already... 83% Roman, but still. Nice. Nice. I like it. Uh, go back to that mission tab, because there's more. There's even more. Because why not just go to town with the bonuses? Uh, where is this? Why can't I find this place? Why can't I find either of these places? Okay, they don't highlight. Oh, oh sort of. No, it's not highlighted. Uh, Tuskia, which I believe around here somewhere. Oh, it is this. It's the same province. That's fair. That's fair. Consolidate. Ninety percent loyalty or higher for uh, one hundred and twenty months. Ten years. Population output. I like it. Uh, integration. Oh, look at that. Ten influence. Take it. Uh, and we gotta. We gotta take that. Unfortunately. Planning for what is? Oh, uh, pick Anum. Where is pick Anum? We need the finder. Pick Anum. That one. 
Oh, but is it the province or is it just the city? No, it can't be the city because the city doesn't produce iron. So the province. The province doesn't produce iron at all. Oh no. Is it one of you? It's one of you, isn't it? It's something I don't own, isn't it? No, it's not something I don't own. Oh, we have to import iron. Um, yeah, look at that. Let's, do it. Let's do it. Let's just do it. Do it to it. Uh, and from... Sure. We come up here. Oh yeah, planning for five military experience. Boom. Done. Take it. And we can do triumph, but I don't really need to give this console guy an extra diplomatic thing. And I don't need to be triumphant right now. I think we'll wait until we get this stuff. Do we need to own cities, eh? Okay. Oh, we need to own a lot more cities. Ah, teleportation. Teleporting the remaining barbarians into the Shadow Realm. Long game? <laughs> I don't know if there's any teleportation in this one. Uh, but we need one more city here and we need two more cities here. And I don't have enough for cities, do I? No, I don't. What do we need for cities? We need, um, gold, we're kind of okay with. We need more influence. I'm gonna need 150 influence to complete those two tasks. Hey. Right. Let's do this. Cozy Bells. Almost done. Yeah. So many claims. So many claims. Oh, and he's allied with Macedon. Okay, so don't fight him yet. Don't fight him yet. And you I can fight. That is a lot of enemies. This is gonna be uh <laughs> this is gonna be an interesting war. Tons and tons of little enemies. What could possibly go? Uh trade route disappeared, we are no longer importing <gasps> livestock. Oh no. Uh, do you need livestock? Technically no. You can get any other food source. And we'd be okay. Grain? That's what we're thinking. Not for my provinces, livestock. Oh, I got lots of places that produce livestock. It's a new pure core. It is a new pure core. Alright, where should we go for food? Well, I need you to be better if you food. Alright, I completely forgot that that is there. So let's take that, let's take that, let's take that. You go here, you go here. This, what could possibly go wrong with this? This is going to turn out horrible. <laughs> there's, there's too many of them, to be honest. But some of them are at war uh, with each other, apparently. So this could go right? Actually. Oh, actually. Are they even all at war with me? Uh, you. Your ten ships are nothing to me. Instantly. Uh, oh, I'll keep these ships there. Are they even or all gone to war with me? No, they didn't all. They're not all here. Who's missing? Who are we at war with? This is an important question. We missed this guy. Sure, all the people I didn't want to join, they're here. But I kind of wanted him to join. Because I can puppet him. He can be a feudal state. Same with him. These guys can't be funerals. But him, he's Roman at heart. At heart, he is a Roman. Same with this guy. You. You, are you still? Yeah, you're still not Roman. Okay, that's fine. We just client state him. We we'll client state him just to get him away from Macedon, because they are allies. I think. Still? No, they're not allies. Oh. No, yeah. Uh, and you can see the barbarians are at my allies' gates. 
Not really my gates, but they're at my allies' gates. I'm gonna have to go over there and do something about that soon. Oh, we're still taking uh, penalties here. I forgot about this. Uh, research advisor? Hey, research advisor. That's a useless position. There you go. Uh, we will remember this crime. We remember all desecration of shrines, regardless of religion. No desecrations can be allowed unless we're doing desecrating. Alright, got this done. One siege done, but uh, I'm kind of worried they're gathering their forces up quite a bit over here. So let's move this army preemptively. We'll see where they go with that army. And, uh, oh, look at that. I haven't done that one. Yep, there they go. That's where they're going. My allies are fleeing like bastards. Thanks, allies. Thanks, guys. Really appreciate it. Did we take this? Did you take this? Oh, that is good timing. You took that. That is good timing. That's some of my allies coming up. That's not so bad. Yeah. That did not turn out as well. <laughs> 10%. Oh, there we go. Back is over. Alright, well, you know what? We lost 9,000. We killed 15. That's not bad. That is not bad. I'll take that. Uh, now, what do we have left? 15,000 troops here. You guys go over there. Uh, 13,000. Yeah, you can go there. And 9,000 come over here. Let's pull you back. And, uh, oh, well, we took that. That's good. Come over here. And, uh, pulling back might not have been the best solution, because. Heck of that, he's got another army. And this guy. This guy. 18. You know what? We'll take the 6 of it We can afford 18. 18 gold. Duncan, so I don't know what they want to call it. What are we calling it in this game? Just Treasury. This is called Treasury. It doesn't have a real name. And my allies are being pretty aggressive, actually. That's good, I like that. I like the good. Oh god. That is my mistake. Uh, can you. No, you're stuck going back. I, I, I got a little bit aggressive, and this guy's just too slow. That is possibly unfortunate. I don't know. We're not doing horribly. And that siege is done. This one can move. Uh, I mean, it doesn't look good. Definitely doesn't look good. Not much bad. Uh, well, maybe you can get there. Can you get there before my donkey dies? No. I can get there before the mountain. Why are you retreating to the enemy territory? That's not what we want. Although he is sieging it. And my armies are coming to engage him. Yeah, you know what? We're gonna leave it there. We're just gonna leave it there. Uh corruption. Hmm. Hmm. Loyalty, who is this guy? Just a go console. Uh No console. Do I really need him to be loyal? I could just. I can bribe him for way cheaper. I have for influence. That's a way better bribe. Okay, how's this going? Oh, much better. Oh, that's much better. Oh, this army. Why didn't you move? I moved you there. That's not what you're saying. I gotta admit, this war is going a lot better than I anticipated. Uh, I expected mass destruction and chaos and death and decay and... And that's not what I'm seeing. I'm seeing a, a lack of massive chaos and death and destruction. Although I don't like that you can't, you can't even send, see the red lines. That's occupied by B. And normally you can see red lines. Barely make out a line. 
I don't like that. Now on anyone with the color red needs to burn first. I don't need to get my. Uh, you know what, go here. And you come over here. Yeah. Let's see, Joey, why, why do these people need to make things complicated for me? Oh, more planes. Are we at war with this guy? Am I at war with you? Yes, I am. him up a little bit in case he needs to back up. And we can relieve him so that he can get some troops. That'd be nice if, you know, he didn't have just 4,000 troops. Even though he's not on my party, I thought I replaced all these guys. When did you leave my party and become one of them? Uh, this guy is for sure. Seriously, when did you stop being cool? And I can't change it. I can't even change it. Oh. That's unfortunate. Hmm. Alright, greenery issues. Always with greenery issues. That's why I don't like greeneries. <laughs> Watch the video tomorrow. Alright, thanks for playing Blitz. We'll uh, talk to you tomorrow probably, or some other time. Enjoy your sleep. Closer to the food. Oh, what is that? Found city cost modifier. Nice. That'll come in handy later on. Uh, let's do the. Let's do the damage craft first. Let's make sure nobody's starving in this empire of Rome. Revolting. No, he's revolting. Who's revolting? Ooh. You're a revolt that's not at war with anyone. So it's not a revolt anymore? I don't even see. That's none of the same names. I think he revolted against somebody that no longer exists. That's, that's good. Hey. Go up here now. Send you there. And you here. And uh, since we're closer to these guys, go and uh, send a fleet in to help pacify that stuff. Ah! Oh. 9,000 dead. That's just good timing. Slavery and you. I thought I told you to go up here. 
Still like when my orders are ignored. Now you, instead of waiting around for that, that's again ignoring my orders. Stop it. Let's go over here and start working on this guy. Finish this one. Let's take over our stuff back. It's gonna give me five aggression, and we can actually take that aggression now. That's not bad. And imprison them all. And he's got a fort in the port already. How many forts does he have in this port? Just one, right? Yep, just one. So that's fine. Cool. Uh, but we don't want to slide or suffer. Don't do this. Don't do that kind of stuff in this empire. There's no learning in this empire. Theater mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. temper. Tumpling. Why do I have an aqueduct here? Why did I do that? I don't know why I did that. It's much better to have taxes. Obviously. Uh, and then these guys. These guys. We really don't need so many forts. We don't need a fort there. We really don't need a fort there. Uh, this port should have a fort in it. And the fort. No ports should have forts. And this city. Granary. I think we learned granary is a useless. He's got two forts actually. Or, you know what? That's um should I let him keep one? What is this? Farmland, cloth. That's a city. Yeah, you can keep it. You can keep it for now. Just for now. Do I want have money? I might have money. Okay. And on that note, look! We have conquered. That is one free investment for the province. Any province. Uh, when it's free, you want to spend it in Rome. Because Rome gets expensive. And uh, let's give him an extra building. 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 Uh, uh, uh. Yeah, you know what? Give him another building. Building slots are good. Can't go wrong with building slots. Another fortress conquered. We've got some enemy troops here that I'm gonna hopefully wipe out. Not wipe out, but not kill a lot of them. It's fine, kill a lot of them. So that they go away and don't come back and try to hunt me. Like these guys, these guys might come back and hunt me sometime. I'm right done there, come over here. That's good, we're making good progress. This war went far better, far, far better than I anticipated. I cannot express- oh no, you son of a gun. He puppeted the guy, oh he, he conquered the guy that I wanted to puppet. It's not cool, we're gonna have to uh, murder him I guess. And you're apparently gonna lose that fight, and you're not gonna get there in time, right? No, of course not. Heavens forbid you just go directly to that province. Uh, okay, well, it was going great. <laughs> it was going exceedingly well, and then stuff like this happens. Where I'm taking a minus 10, and he's taking a plus 11, and my nearest ally army is very far away. But we're holding. He's, he's actually holding. He's killing more of them than us. Let's see, what is that? We're taking a minus penalty. He's taking a leadership bonus. He's got the bonus here. Why am I winning this, actually? 
I should not have won that. We actually won that. I don't know why we won that. Okay, there's gotta be something that tells me. Was it discipline? Maybe it was the discipline. Should have lost that fight. Like there's no. He's found, like he even has more discipline than me. He's got more discipline. I was taking a town power you. He's got a better leader than us. It's Thirteen versus my seven. So he's way better leader. And he had the tactic bonus. I should not have won that fight. By all accounts, I should not have won that fight. Even the game, estimating beforehand, said I was going to lose that fight. By a lot. I, I don't get it. Not that I'm complaining that I won and he lost, just that it makes no sense that I won. And he lost. Okay, we're taking we're take we're take a victory. Just move on with my, my life, my existence. Everything I once knew is in the garbage. Everything I thought I knew is useless and worthless. It's fine, it's cool. We have actually did very well in this part. I'm liking the outcome. Why? Oh, he's still alive! He's still alive! He's got two provinces! <laughs> the day has gotten better. At last. Uh, can I go to war with him yet? No, not yet. Uh, I gotta wait to go to war with him. Uh, so that could actually turn out to be an advantage again that he's still alive and he I can go to war with him after. Oh, was it you I started? Shit. I gotta um I gotta wait for a little while. Cause I gotta fabricate a claim against him first. Yeah it might take a little bit of time. More than I would like. Uh, these guys are very rich. That was like nine nine pops that I just took there. That was a that was a big city. It wasn't even a city, it was just a fort. With a port. That fort in the port really had a lot of people in it. And we got the extra buildings. But before we go to that, you, I owe you a temple. Now Rome. I need more of something. Anything, anything at all. You already got two farms, got a quarter law. Theaters, temples, you don't really need them. Although, you know, maybe you kind of do need them. What, what is, uh, with 92% and 94%? No, you don't really need them. Alright, let's get you. I don't want to give you an aqueduct, you always have food problems. I don't want more people. I just want more productive people who give me stuff. Do, 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 mill, boundary. I do build armies here every now and then. So maybe that starting experience would be nice, kind of, sort of, not really. I usually build supply ships. Or supply. Donkeys. What are they all? Uh, local trade route. You know, that might not be so bad. We do a lot of trading here. We do a lot of trading here. Hmm. 
Hmm. Hmm. Hmm. Hmm. Well. Well, well, well. I'm gonna say Foundry Road. We just go with it. And then you. You, my friend. Oh, we're short on attacks, so first of all, you can have attack size. And then. You know, since you're a port, have a market. Uh, you can have a market, and I'm out of money. Okay. To war. My army coming down here. I need my army to hurry up. Oh, the head of the Fabi family is dead. And he was not important in any way, shape, or form, apparently. Uh, except why. Are you minus 30? Oh, right. Because you're in a crappy province. Uh, okay. Minus 24, okay. Okay. Uh, yeah, we'll go with it. You know what, we'll go with it. It's fine. Nothing more I can really do there at this point. Okay, over here. We need a new city. Who can I build a city in that's not going to take a sheep or a resource that I actually want? Fish, fish. Okay, well, I wonder if I look at some of my other cities, do I have, let's see, wine, wine, iron, so iron survives, does iron always survive, iron seems to survive a lot for cities, how do these horses survive, horses in the city, <laughs> yeah, and uh, you know what, base metal supply survives. So, base metals. Uh, let's get rid of this pathetic mine. And I don't have 200 gold. I forgot about that. It was half a requirement that I was meeting. And then I had the other half. And now I have a different half. What is going on over here? Okay. That's that. You, what, what is, what is, okay. You know, it's done. They're dead. It's fine. Move on. Next fort. Hey, you are done. Maybe they eventually got all these barbarians under control. It's nice. Usually I have to do that myself. That's, that's good that they did it. Wait, right, you uh, apparently won't do a separate piece right now? Okay, that's fine. Why would you do a separate piece? I have all your stuff. Barbarians! Oh, why are you not in your territory defending it? This was, um, that was bad. You should have been there. What were you thinking? Ah, oh, I got slaves. Yay. And money. Yay. And this is all taken over now. Okay. Let's just pull my army all the way all the way back. That army can stay around for now. Do, do, do. What is left to do? Hey! This is good news. Oh, this is good news all around. You know, he's injured. He's injured? Really? Maimed. Maimed! Is he gonna die? Uh, very slow. It doesn't do anything. Health. Infection. He has an infection. That is great. Because this guy, this guy's a dick. And he needs to die. He's a leader, and he's one of these guys, so he needs to die eventually. 
And the question is... Do we do science, or do we pray to the gods? And since I want him to die, we're gonna pray to the gods. There's just no alternative there. It's very clear. The god's will is for me to be a dictatorship. <laughs> There's just no other way. There's nothing else it could possibly mean. And another fort taken over. Okay. You. How come I can't do peace with you separately? I have all your stuff. You should do peace with me separately. This guy would do peace with me separately. This guy would do peace with me separately. Why don't you do the thing that they do? He's gotta have other territory somewhere. You know what? It's not important. It's fine. It's done. It's over. The war is coming to an end. Riff or riff out him. This guy's good. Jungle Boy 2727 27, raiding me for a party of four. How dare you raid me? Welcome. What were you guys uh, playing today? Ooh, money. Money. Wizard 101. I've never heard of that game. I actually looked at your channel yesterday and I saw you play that a lot. But I've never even heard of it. Until then. What is that game about? I'm gonna client state this guy. That's what I wanted to do. I wanted to client state him. And five out of seven. Five out of seven. Okay. Hmm. A carrot based spell. <laughs> okay. Okay. I'll take it. I'll have to watch you. I'll have to watch you play sometime. Figure out what it's about. Oh, card based. Okay. Well, for those that are reading with Jungle Boy, uh, my name is Stipix. I uh, play a ton of Paradox games, a ton of Grand Strategy games, a lot of other strategy games too. It doesn't always have to be Paradox. And uh, yeah, mostly I'm just, you know, having fun, playing games. Why not? Right now, this guy. We gotta figure out what we're gonna do with some of these guys, though. So him, we can take some territory from, for sure. Why am I not taking territory? There we go. And we have a claim on that, right? I don't have a claim on that. You missed what I said? Oh dear. So, my name is Stevix. I will reintroduce myself. My name is Stevix. Uh, I play a lot of Paradox games, a lot of Grand Strategy games, uh, and just a lot of strategy games in general. Occasionally I'll dip into other games as well. Just, you know, for fun. Just for fun. And in terms of this game, right now I am playing Rome. Oh, we are playing Rome. And we're doing pretty good. Uh, these guys that are colored here, I've never noticed this before when you're in the uh, war screen. The guys that are colored are actually my allies, with the exception of this guy right here. But the rest of them are all my puppets. All my little beautiful puppets. They're gonna help me win wars. And then the rest is me, is actually me. And then you got some some guys like Macedon over here butting up against me. 
clearly itching for a war, which eventually we are going to have to kill them because uh, I see no alternative. They're just getting too big and uh, they're getting into my territory. I don't like that. And we just fought all these barbarian tribes and we did very well in it. I was, uh, it was surprisingly a lot easier than I thought it was going to be, which is great. I'm just going to take some stuff in this piece. I need that. And we don't want all of this guy. We just want most of him. We can keep that port. And that thing. Actually, you can keep this port. I'll take that port. Yeah, you can keep that. And... I think that's all we can do in this peace treaty here. For now. The good news is, they have a defensive alliance with a guy that was not in the war with me, who I do want to puppet. And I do want to puppet him eventually. So I'm going to immediately start fabricating a claim against him. Just so I can go to war with him. And the rest of these guys, right away. In the meantime, though, these ones, all their leaders can be imprisoned. There are the guys from this country here that no longer exists. Isn't conquest fun? <laughs> Uh, and now we gotta, we gotta do some economy stuff here. Although, these barbarians apparently do not have many cities and other things. So there's not a lot of economy that I have to deal with. Uh, you don't need aqueducts. You definitely don't need a granary. You do need a theater. And a tax place. And over here, this nice big city doesn't need a library. No reading allowed in my empire. But there is theater and temples, but no libraries. Reading is not permitted. It is a banned, banned practice in ancient Rome. Alright, and I should build this city over here now that I have the money and the influence. Oh, death. Somebody died. Who died? That guy. Who was nobody special, so we we'll replace him for nobody special. That's the name of the game. If they're not special, just replace them. That army's coming back. Oh yeah, I have stuff over here. That will take uh, a little while. Claim ready in May, and it's September. May of next year? Oh, that's going to take way longer than I thought. That's awful. That is, oh, wait a minute, May 625. 36.23. No, <laughs> it's going to take way, way longer. Oh my. That uh, was not what we expected. Well, I might as well lay claims to this guy then. And you, Macedon. I got lots of claims on you already. Who's this guy? No, no, nobody special.
And it would be nice if these two, instead of fighting each other, would have allied and gone after Macedon for me. That would just be, you know, worked out quite nicely. But that's not what they did. And now I always suffer for their errors. Uh, nobody special. Okay. Okay, I really gotta go after this province at some point. No, maybe that's what I do until May. May of 625. Nah, I'll leave my armies here. We just, we raid it out. We raid it out. It's okay. Playing Smash. <laughs> as long as you're, you know, around. That's good enough. Good enough for me. Enjoy Smash. Ooh, so many slaves. Okay, if they're already a slave, why am I taking a penalty? No, I'll just strike Earth. The slaves can stay slaves. Don't need the slaves to become slaves. I, I don't know, that was a weird event. That was a wrong event. And, oh, I don't have enough money. I gotta get a few more cities up here. Preferably not this one, because this one has sheep. I don't want to give up the food. So, this can be a city. It's got stone. Once we've uh, got the money for it. Oh! I know where we can get money. Imprisoned by sowing slaves. That's... That's how we do this. Uh, this guy is following my party, so he can, he can live. Uh, that's a kid. That kid can live. Okay, cave kid's living. They're, they're young. They'll learn. Uh, you're a member of my party? You can live. You're a member of my party? You can live. This guy is a member of my party? You can live. Sim family. Uh, who's she? 14 years old. Yeah, she can live. I think, uh, who are you? You're 36, you have no party. You're an heir? You're an heir of what? No, we'll look at that in a second. All right, clear these people. Okay, that didn't work, refresh. There we go. All right, now, so let's stay free. And you can just go. You, you're gonna. Okay, what is your deal? Oh, he's from the country that I puppeted. Well, he can be released, I guess. He's an heir to the throne. That's fine. You can live. Uh, the rest of you. Slavery. Slavery. Definitely slavery. And most definitely slavery. And you two can just... Oh, I can ransom you guys, actually. How much money are you giving? Why isn't it being accepted? Something's going on there. Why? Oh, because I destroyed this country. And they just bugged out. That's okay. Just a minor bug. And now we have money. And I can build a city. Over here. And that will help some of these missions. Now, what is... So, in this one. We gotta import two foods. Grain, vegetable, salt, fish, or the other thing. 
Uh, what do they currently have? They have fish and they have salt. They have grain and sheep. What was the other option? Vegetables. I don't think we have vegetables. So that's... Oh, we do have vegetables. So I can get one. And you can have, uh, I don't know. Grain, livestock, livestock, livestock. Maybe what, I'll just line these up so we can get them all finished at the same time. I just need one more city up top here. And that's going to take a little while. I want puppets. Gotta have my puppets. May 1st. Why is this taking so long? Usually it does not take that long to get that. From CK2, it's uh, it's pretty different. So CK2 is more of a character simulation game, um, whereas this is more of just Rome. I mean, not necessarily Rome, just the the ancient era type of thing. Um, it's a little less character based, unless you're playing as like um, as a monarchy. Then it's a little more character based. You can collect some of these little bloodlines uh, from these major Greek states. But otherwise, it's not as character based compared to CK2. Uh, the other thing is, you're actually an empire in this. CK2, you're always. Um, relying on vassal puppet states and stuff like that. Uh, whereas this, you're, you're, it's more like Europa Universal. Europa Universals. Uh, where you actually have, you know, giant provinces. You're, you're actually a giant empire. Crusader Kings, you are, normally only have like seven or eight little territories for yourself. Uh, depending on your settings, you might only have two or three little cities for yourself. So it, it's very much, CK2 is very much more of a character based type of thing. Uh, having said that, this isn't completely like Europa. Uh, you do have to rely on like governors and stuff for bigger provinces, uh, which is what you see here. So this giant province of... Uh, I don't know how to pronounce that. Um, Seals Pine Gull. Uh, it's got multiple little territories in it and uh, tiny little spaces as well. I think it's province, territory is the small one, province is the big one, and Gull, uh, Cusp, Cusplain, Cuspine, I don't know, would be the um, region. And then you have different regions. Uh, there's Transapol, Transapol, Pine, Transol. Oh god, I'm off of names. <laughs> and you have governors for that, and you gotta kind of manage some of these families and keep them happy. I know, it's kind of a cross. It's a cross between Crusader Kings and Europa. And where in this province? And you gotta keep your people happy as well. Which unfortunately means sometimes you gotta be harsh to keep them happy. <laughs> it's just the way the cookie crumbles. Alright, and it's almost ha oh, we went from May to April. That's good news. So, April, we should have a cozy bell ready. And we're puppet this guy. Oh, he lost his other province. Did he lose another province? Oh, he did. Okay, well, you need to stop losing stuff. So I can conquer you properly. Where is... Oh, way over there. 
That's a weird one. Alright, we have Flame. I'm gonna make him my puppet. I'm gonna make this guy a puppet. He's gonna get involved in the war. Uh, this country is gonna get involved and we are currently gonna have a claim by the time that war ends. That guy we don't care about. This guy is way over here. He's, he's not gonna do anything. And this guy... Uh, we already invaded him once, so hey, yeah, it's fine. Take him. Uh, you go there, you go there, you come stand in between. And I think you can go each one. Can you go there from there? Yes, you can. Go stand in between. Trade with the superior vegetables. Oh, my precious vegetables. Um, sure. What's the one? Oh, we already uh, defeated his army. That's good. Snake. Oh, that guy's army's gone now. Or it still lives. Sort of. I don't know where it's gonna go. Maybe it's gonna go all the way over here. Oh yeah, it is. This troops is gonna retreat all the way to the nearest friendly territory of this place. <laughs> way over there. This war will be over by the time he gets back. Or could be over by the time he gets back. After we've done this war, we're going to go do some damage in Spain. And then, uh, maybe we'll take on Macedon? Uh, you know, he just keeps getting bigger. Uh, becoming a city. Oh, yes. That is. Oops. One thing at a time. You go over here. You don't need to stand there looking sad anymore. Uh, come take on his army. Or stand next to his army. And then the second thing. Is, oh, for the love of God. No, we're fine. In this place. Hey, Metro Talk. Oh, well, that's not a huge great bonus. Basically, just these three places, these three cities here, will get 2% uh, local population growth. That's not much. And this guy. Rome owns three more cities. Uh, that one's more valuable. Or towards that. That should be uh, six months. Sorry, ten months. No, five months. Five months. Where's my math? No, ten months. There's my math. Ten months until we get this. Math. We don't do that here. <laughs> uh, um, well. I'm not opposed to getting tyranny. And I'm not opposed to moving him. Yeah, he's kind of a crappy governor. No, he's okay governor. Six. Okay, which stat is it? Governors use... Governors use that. Finesse. And he... Has six finesse. He's not a mad leader. And he's a member of somebody's house. And he's a member of a party. And really, as a governor, he has no power in the Senate. So he's doing fine. Yeah, he's doing he's doing okay. Senate representative. Uh oh, you know what? He's 
Oh, he's got a lot of corruption, though. No, you know, he's doing fine. Just a little corruption. It's okay. Just a little corruption. It's okay. It's okay. That is done. Let's uh, see if we can fight this guy's army. Gauge him with my two armies. Guess two is better than one. Gonna retreat there. Oh, somebody died. Uh, just the head of the Quinali family. Apparently, he did not hold any position anyway. Oh, he's got five ships. Now oh, let him run away. Let him flee. Keep his ships. So that I can use them later. Oh, damn it. You know, okay, which one of you has the higher military? Uh, okay, apparently neither of you, but you're older and of the house. Of the correct political party, so you can go chase him now. Chase down that army, actually. Do I even need to? Here's a good question. Do I even need to? Continue to fight. Feudal, feudal, that's those two, that's what I want. And uh, I got a thing for you. And yeah, that's all I really need. That's all I was really fighting for here. It's those three things. So we're done, we're done that war. I need to take the rest of his stuff. It's uh, useless to me. Imprison the leaders. And with him and him on our side, we have increased our alliance base. And this guy. And hopefully that will be enough at some point to fight this giant blue blob of France. Oh, sorry, not France. Macedon. Wrong game. Wrong blue blob. And uh, we're not worried about barbarians. Very much. I guess we do have to keep that. Alright, we'll keep these forts for now. Just in case anything comes up. And. Yeah, there's no cities up here. I have no cities since. That's a shame. Shame. Alright, give me all your armies. Let's uh, take them all. We'll go down here to Pisa. Go to Pisa, get some pizza. Okay. If I can get all my armies there. Do I just have five? Yeah, I have five. And we will uh, invade this guy. Maybe not this guy in particular, but you know, all of these guys are going to really need to start invading here. He is definitely the biggest. <laughs> I don't know how this happened. I'm not entirely sure how he became the biggest and the baddest in the area, but he has definitely taken it by storm. A voice behind bars. <sighs> My culture will lose popularity. I'm okay with that. I don't want to silence the person that is my party. Please. And the rest of you can be sold in slavery. This guy, this guy's still a bug. That's okay. Right, done. Yeah. Ooh, the epic writer. You know, I don't care about this guy having a big epic thing written about him, so no, you can go away. 
That's for military. Three guy. Who is this guy? You? Why did they give you military access? What have you done for me lately? Nothing. Nothing at all. You need no access. You shall get me. And low food. Why are you low food? Uh, you know, you hate to see it. How's it still off food? Going month. All over. See this positive gain? Yep. They're good there. They're fine. They got food. It's all good. Oh, except this port does not have a fort in it. I think ports should have forts. It's like a requirement. Don't know why the AI doesn't get this. It's a requirement of life. Every port must have a fort. I want to go to that other city. I need to get a third city. I don't have enough blood of one for my third city. Where do I want a third city? This is a good question. Let's, uh, let's put it over there. Let's grab the influence. Alright, troops, load up. We have another war that needs to be fought. In Liberia. Uh, where should we start? You know, let's start with the big guy. Let's take the big guy on first. Take these guys on and then the big guy. That's a good plan. for the war. Into our ally territory. Oh, this guy's still alive. Wow. Yeah, you definitely need to die. Now what's left? Oh, they have a defensive pack with each other. Uh, okay. Well, it's unfortunate. You're... Especially for this guy. His allies are about to disappear. Oh, what? Oh, he's, he's been doing special. Yeah. Do, do, do. Lose his position and power. Embezzler. He's a governor? He's not that good of a governor. Oh, he's not a governor. What? He's not a governor, what is he? He's in here, isn't he? No, he? Oh, yeah, there he is. He is dealing with uh, national happiness. Well. I would say. We should just leave him alone. Oh, and we are on the brink of civil war. We need to uh, make this guy happy, apparently. Punic. Oh, what a dirty bastard. Alright, bribing. Oh, bribing him did nothing. Okay, well. Too late. Give, uh, give free hands? That'll work on him. 
And the death of a governor from Dysteria. What a shame. Oh, and he's the guy that matters the least. Alright. Who can we put over there? That does not matter one bit. Let's put him in charge. Okay, when I put him in charge, I didn't know it was going to be a pain away, but it's fine. Alright, more. We must take Spain for Rome. And that's stability. That's nice. Free stability. there as well. And then you come up here. Oh, so much better. Oh, there's no fort there. Oh, uh, whoops. That's my bad. I thought there was a fort there. Yeah, go there. The console had a son. If the console has a sun. Whoops. Uh, nothing particularly good there. Oh, we can take it over, that's good. Cruising along. And I have enough influence to build a city over here now. Uh, I was gonna build it here, the wine. And is the claim of him not yet done, eh? of the Valumi family. What a shame. If only we cared about him. Oh yeah, did I mention that in this game I'm a brutal dictator? I'm trying to be... <laughs> I'm trying to be as brutal of a dictator as I can. I have 50 tyranny. Should be able to just establish a dictatorship whenever I feel like it, but apparently not. Apparently there's uh, certain rules to it, and uh, being a massive tyrant is just not good enough. A uh, citizen and a freeman. Sweet. Establish another thing against him, so it doesn't really matter where. 
As long as we're taking a bunch of his territory in the next war. That's all that counts. Oh, I guess it does matter where, because he's got stuff in France. I don't want that crap. I don't want those garbage provinces, I want this stuff. Alright, that should be enough. So you... Alright, I can't get you. I'm gonna do this properly. That done the way. Why is that province? No, it doesn't. Okay, that's fine. Yeah, that's fine, except I don't have enough. Score apparently. Apparently taking all of your stuff was not enough. Apparently taking all of this guy's stuff was just not enough for him. To, you know, surrender and give up and give me all his stuff. Don't even need all of it, I just want most of it. Okay, you can't do peace. Can I kind of do peace? Wait a minute. He's got stuff over here. Wow, okay, I guess I have to take that. I uh, didn't come close to taking all of his stuff. There's still lots of stuff for me to take from him. I can't even get over there. No, that's fine. As long as we take this. Which, uh, should work out. Do not lose that fight. Go on, allies. Don't lose that fight. Oh, you need to go over there. That's fine. Is that enough? No, that wasn't enough. Ugh. Ah. The war continues. It's like a never ending war. Start seeing him as a rival. Eh, eh, sure, whatever. It's fine. Live live already. spread these armies around a little bit. He doesn't just have stuff up here, he's got stuff way down here as well. Gotta be able to conquer everything. this guy. No, that's him as well. <laughs> oh, wait, about time. Let's assume. Yes. Spain. Time. It shall all be mine. I do that. One tribe at a time. Spain shall be mine. Except we gotta work on this whole. Tyranny stuff. <laughs> okay, that can go away. Don't really need that fort either. Do they have no cities? They have no cities around here. That's just lame. There's no cities anywhere. Uh, that's almost. Hey, why does it only say one out of three? 
Did I build in the wrong place? Oh. Oh dear god. I didn't need three cities up here. I need to expand these three. So they have no free spots. Ah, for the love of god. Misunderstood. Slight misunderstanding. Can I cancel that city? Is it too late? Where is it going up here? Can it be cancelled? No, it can't be cancelled. Ah, uh, well, that's unfortunate. It's good intention, just not necessary. Not needed at all. Alright, let's get our troops back here. And then we'll begin phase two of our invasion of the Spaniards. Scientific breakthrough. Oh, we don't really want a scientific breakthrough though. Any religious advances? You ah. Where's our technology? Do I need any of this? Oh, yeah, I do want some of that. Oh no. There's only so much money that goes around. Alright, this time. How old are you? 44, yeah. Uh, no kids? Great. You're all going to slavery. Nobody gets rid of the least. I need the money. I need lots of money. Selling more people. I mean, not selling more people. Releasing old people does not help my bank account. And you, why is your morale so low? It's not the way this is supposed to work. Oh, he's got 47 armies. Oh, he's got no manpower though. Yeah, this will go well. This should go well. Who's his allies? You? Who are you? You're way over there. You're way over there. You're... I don't know where you are. Who are you? Where are you? Why are you over there? Okay. And you're... I just fought you. Well, I was not counting on him having allies up here. But... You know, it should be okay. He doesn't have a lot of allies. They're not big. It should be fine. Let's just take him out. It's only got 47,000 troops. It should be fine. Yep, here's what we do. We'll go to this guy join. Oh, we gotta go up there. Okay. We're do some fighting up there first. And we're aiming for the forts down here. And my allies will all join in and they can just run around and fight each other a bit, I guess. Nobles. From where? What is this place? That place? No. Nobles? I don't need nobles. We need slaves. Oh, this is 24,000 troops. You know what? Let's, let's rally. Uh, 6,000. Yeah, okay, we got all that stuff. Yeah, we already defeated them. It's okay. okay. Uh, actually, would he uh, would he win? Uh, whoops, sorry, I was going a little crazy there. Uh, I think if my allies allies get there, we will win this fight. Yeah, he does not have uh, good troops. In fact, he is still military level 1, so his troops are truly garbage in comparison to our level 14. These, uh, these foolish barbarians, they never stand a chance. They don't learn. They don't learn now compared to us Romans. 
which is probably why they have no cities anywhere. That kind of explains a few things. Well, apparently you have a big defensive pact, so that's fine. We'll skip that guy for now. Don't appreciate him getting my way, but we'll skip him for now, it's fine. I'm okay with that. this guy a little bit. Probably not. No. No, we don't need to. Uh, oh, my allies. Oh, my poor little ally. You guys need to group up. City got built. I didn't need it. Oh, what's going on over here? Hey now. That's not nice. Let's uh, go help the allies out a little bit. Oh, they can both go there. I got that. That's good news. They can both go there. Okay. And that's fine. Build these cities. Yep. We built the city. And troops dead. Slaves. And now uh, we got a new Kazi bell against him. Or a new claim against him, I should say. Uh, not that it matters. Kinda matters, it helps later on with the aggressive expansion score. It's always important to keep an eye on that. I thought he's taking away these troops. Get over here. Come on guys. And I didn't realize I was in a big giant battle. Uh, but apparently we won it, so that's good. Well, I guess my allies joined me. That's good. That's good for them. It's good that they played as a team. Hmm. Shame of a governor. Let's say uh, local happiness. Let's go for it. Oh, I need a new governor. Oh, that was my bad. <laughs> That's not quite what I expected. It's okay. Now, these guys. Any uh, pissed off families? No, not really. Go down. And another fast. Fortresses are just falling, crumbling around our. Another 
governor died. Let's give it to this family for now. This is slowly recovering. Okay. Four thousand more troops dead. Another enemy general captured and sold into slavery. These barbarians are truly, truly barbaric. Oh, no, come on. Come on, really? We just ignored it. Ignored what was happening in front of us. That's great, guys. Great job, guys. Everyone else is playing as a team. <laughs> Except for those armies. Take that. And another seat. Another fortress down. Hmm. I don't like the looks of this color. But, uh, we'll see. Oh yeah, that's not going well. Oh, that's not going well at all. Uh, oh, yeah, we won. Okay, that worked. It's all good. <laughs> we lost 4,000 and they lost 2,000, but we won. The point is, we won. That's really all that's important. Okay, there's more to it that. But in this particular case, it's just important that we won. I'm happy enough with the victory. Okay, oh, 8,000. Oh, I thought I captured someone. Did I capture him? Oh, apparently, I didn't capture him. Killed a lot of enemies. Didn't capture anything, but uh, killed a lot. Siege, siege, siege. Everything must be sieged. I gotta admit, I never realized how much of a difference that tech score made. Uh, but definitely, like, he, he was decimated, and I think it was because of the tech score. Minor character died of a heart attack. Ooh. What a way to go. And he can only be replaced by useless people. Except for you. You're not useless. You're at my party. And you have nothing good to really contribute. That's great. Maybe I should not have picked him. And this is why you don't puppet barbarian tribes. I'm now realizing this. This is actually- oh, but this guy's got eight. That guy's got four. That guy's got four. That guy's got three, at least. 
How did this guy with one military expand so much so late in the game? Something's not right there. Uh, petition, maneuver. Oh, so many, so many. Oh, but this is one of my guys. No, he's doing a great job. Fantastic job. He's doing a fantastic job. Nothing to see there. No corruption whatsoever. Okay, this is all going to be taken by the time I get up here. Why did you stop? <laughs> Why does the game always do that to me? It just randomly stops. We're marching, we're marching, and we stop. Seriously? This guy's out running me here? Okay, well, he is out running me. So maybe that's what it is. Maybe that's how he lived for so long, he just outran every enemy army, sieged capitals, and moved on. Declared mission accomplished. Oh, we gotta go, we gotta go over there. Miraculous recovery, oh no. You mean you're no longer dying of an infection? Ah, oh, that's a shame. That is a shame. And I would say we don't need to continue this war any further. Although, we could just continue a little bit longer to take more of his stuff. Just, you know, for, you know, experience sakes? I, I don't know. I don't know what good justification for these actions are. All I know is it's going to be useful to me to take that over completely. Now we start moving some of our armies into position for the next wars. The next battles against Spain. Although, this aggressive expansion did not go down as much as I had hoped. How's Macedonia doing? How's he doing? He's he's got some allies. Nothing special. Is he allied with? Who's this guy? Oh, that guy. That guy's nothing special. That guy and this guy. Oh, way down there. No, that's not him. Who's this guy? Ah. Uh, oh, it is them. Okay. He's not really allied if anyone's special. 130 cohorts. That's a lot of manpower though. That is, that's a lot of money, it's a lot of manpower. Why am I losing money? Why am I losing money? I should not be losing that much money. Not sure what's happening there. Wages? No? Oh yeah, wages are pretty expensive. Okay. Don't know why it's expensive, but okay. It's fine. Uh, now. Comes the tricky part. Because I have claims to some of this stuff, but I gotta find it. Not that one. Why do some of these give me.
Oh, maybe cities. Cities cost more. That makes sense. Uh, is this one? Is this one? This has a lot of cities in it, but uh, no, nope, not one of mine. Okay, not you. Do you have a claim here? Yes, I do. You got that claim. Where is that? Way up there? Really? I claimed the coastal province. Okay. That's fine. Uh, you don't have a thing. You don't have a thing. Ah, claim. Ah, another coastal. Okay. We still beside each other. There's another claim. And it's down here. Okay. That that is a that is a little snaky. Okay. It's fine. It's fine. It's good. Uh oh, another claim. Ah, oh, there we go. That's not bad. Another claim. Anyway, in the middle. Okay. That's much better. That looks better. Oh, that looks even better. That's fantastic. That is 20 though. We're, we're getting getting close. Nothing there, nothing there, nothing there. Nothing there. Uh, nothing there. Not there. Uh, nothing there. There we go. Okay, that's not bad. That's good. Good territory to take. Uh, and this, yeah, that's perfect. Perfect. It's looking a little bit better. All we're missing is this. And that's going to cost me 8 aggressive expansion. That's why I need claims on stuff. <laughs> that's uh, So we're taking 23 aggressive and we have 20 so yeah we're just going to have to... Uh, maybe I can just mission. Let him keep half of it, most of it. Oh, and just kind of take the, the coastal line there. I think that's fair. Keeps me connected by land. So I'm not trying to, you know, send ships from here to there and back and forth. And just take the coast. It's good. Uh, and this. I kind of am willing to take the point eighty for that. Yeah. I'm willing to take the hit for that. And that's it. I think that's good. Any uh, nations can be released? No, we don't really want to release any nations, actually. Client states? Not really. No, I think this is good. I think this is where we take it. I think I'd rather keep him big and low on technology than split him up into a bunch of little states that might all gain technology and be ultimately stronger than the one big state. So, this is good. That's good. That's good. That's a lot of provinces. Uh, in this... Oh, this is actually new. I'm gonna have to take this stuff. Uh, but this is a whole new region right here. Brand new governor and everything. Let's, uh, let's see what kind of damage we can do to uh, the political enemies. Yeah, let's actually... let's. Let's look at who's in the government here. Uh, he's already governor. He's a co-consul. I don't think you can make him a governor. This guy's a general of the second legion, which is a small legion that does nothing. So he's he's fine where he is. Can I make the co-consul? Uh, what's this guy? No, I don't think I can. I don't think he can. Right, who's also prominent in this party? Uh, the you have the consul, and that's it. You have the admiral of the first navy, and some researcher. But let me check that admiral of the first navy. Why is he so influential in the senate? Why are you so influential in the senate? You're you're a head of a navy. You're not supposed to have power. Navies don't have power. Is he gonna die soon though? Yeah, he'll die in 61 months. So let's leave him alone. Of gout. He's gonna die of gout. Uh, who's the second? The researcher. Claudius. 
Chaos Claudius something. Chaos Claudius, Chaos Claudius. Be you them. Chaos Claudius, yeah. Head of a family. Blah blah blah. We need to move him. That is not a good place for you to be, my friend. Let's change. Doesn't even have to be somebody good. In fact, we'll just make that guy it. And then, just because I know he will complain and whine. Oh no, where is he? Was that him? That's him. Yep, that's him. It's not a good leader, but. But look! No more Senate influence. His party shall crumble without his support. That's good news. That's good news. I like that. So that's how that's done. You gotta make crappy people governors. <laughs> Get them away from the Senate. And now we have another problem though. There is a lot of disloyalty around here. Uh, where is... Let's see what... Etria... Uh, you. You're the worst of the worst. And you're already harsh. Let's try... Um, doing that. And maybe that'll help a little bit. Once it's done. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. It should increase by 0.10, and when I conquer that guy, it'll be an extra one. Alright, let's get our armies back, back into position. Ready yourselves for another war! And, uh, actually... Go there. You can come down here. I'm ready to take that fort. Oh, oh, stupid mouse. There we go. And you can come there. You know what, you can actually just go right there. That's fine. You're there ready. You're coming over here. Shut up, armies. We don't have all year. Oh, and this is done. Fantastic. That's a free thingy. Uh, this, you know, it actually doesn't really matter that much. Population capacity. Although, that's permanent, isn't it? Yeah, that's permanent. So that, that kind of helped. And uh, we finished all the missions here. We improved Italia. Slightly. Oh, the triumph. I didn't read what that gave me. Uh, well, shit. Is there going to be a pop-up? No, there's not a pop-up. Uh, Triumph in Italy, did it, did it give you something permanent on here? Conqueror, no. Provincial Pure, nope, that's not it. Uh, no, okay, well, I don't know what it gave me. Occupation, welcome, no, that's something else. Roman, Colonia, that might have been it, actually. Do you have a Colonia thing? No, you don't. Do you? Uh, yes, you do. It might have been the Colonia thing. But why don't you have one? Alright, well, nothing more I can do. You, why do you lack food? Why do you lack food? Go there and stop for a second. Just, I don't know why you're lacking food. There, see, you can get food and walk at the same time. I don't know why you can't get food and walk at the same time. Hey, right, missions. Finish this damn mission. Uh, what do we got? What's this? I don't know what this is. Where is this? The Hajita. Oh, this is up here. Right? No, maybe not. It's spelt slightly differently. No, that is it. That is it. So that's for up here. 
uh, which puts me on a course against him. And I want to kind of avoid that for now. Uh, Caspia Gull is this, right? Yes. So this is a good one to do, because I'm half done it. And uh, he's not going to interfere. It's going to be like this stuff here. That would be the last of it. So that's good. We definitely want this. This will give us a bunch of bonuses and uh, really help pacify this area that we just took earlier. Uh, Freeman own settlement, blah, 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 blah. Yeah, that helps us settle stuff. This is good. This is a very good event. Chain. Mission chain. And uh, who are you at war with? That is wreaking so much havoc. Oh, a bunch of people. Ooh. Uh, sorry, buddy. I didn't know you were going to get conquered by people. It's fine. It's fine. It's all fine. It's good. It's fine. Uh, excellent initiative. Uh, we also do want to encourage. So actually, we do lose a lot of money. But we get uh, population conversion speed gain for quite a while. Oh, but that's just in, just in that one province. Which province is that? Here's an important question. It's just this province. Uh, so for that kind of money, we don't we don't need the gain right now. It's already like sixty percent, sixty five percent Roman, seventy five percent our religion. So yeah, we don't need a massive gain anymore. Would it be nice fifty years ago, hundred years ago, something like that? Yeah, excellent initiative. these guys. You must all gather around the Christmas tree. Oh, really? Governor? Governor died? Uh, he was brother blah 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 blah. It doesn't matter. He was this guy. Now, this is another one of those times you know what? Let's find somebody who is a big supporter. Like that other researcher who is now in charge. How? Why? Why is that researcher so damn powerful? Really? 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 Oh, because he became the head. Of course. Of course he did. That makes complete sense. That makes complete sense. He became the head of the family when the other guy died. And I'm screwed because of it. Well. Uh, this guy's gonna die way too soon. 61 years old and he gives... God, it's garbage. They're all garbage. Each and every one of these people. Garbage. Alright, well... We're still going to put him in charge. It's fine. Uh, and then down here we can put that dude whose name I don't actually know. That's a problem. I'm going by look. And he he's the one. 26.79 power base for that party. He is in charge and now he has no centered influence. Fantastic what you like to see. That's what I like to see. That will drop and that'll go up. And why won't you die? You, you my good sir. Gout, 57 more months. 79 years old. God, at some point, at some point, people just need to let go. Alright, now, I really like this, but it's not going to help me with my money situation. I like this, again, not going to help me with my money. I don't think anything here helps me with money. 
<clears throat> if I wait another 20 some odd years, this will give me money. <laughs> That's not going to be useful. That's not going to be useful anytime soon. You will give me happiness eventually, but not that important. In the grand scheme, loyalty of generals is very useful. I like to not have to bribe my generals every, you know, few years. National Freeman output. Now that does give me money and gives me manpower. But is it worth it? Is it truly enough? Is it ever truly enough? 3%, it just seems so little. And yet, in a nation with 11,000 people, I mean, a good portion of them have got to be free people. Where is the number? Where can I see a good number? I know I can see it if I go to an actual province, but uh, just one province is not an accurate reflection. Although, like 17 free men right here. Sixty-four percent output, giving us 0 0.08 tax and thirty-two manpower. I mean, the slaves give us more money. I have half as many slaves, and they give me more money. Is there slave happiness or slave output? Uh, where was it? What was the other freemen and tribesmen? Tribesmen are useless. Ah. Uh, Go off the Freeman. I mean, at the very least, we get more manpower out of it. We should get enough money. We should get a little bit of money. Just a little, not a lot. Enough. Oh, stupid food. Province lower T plus 10. It's currently at 37. Better than nothing. Alright, let's see. 1.9. Where does it go to? What is. What does 3% get us? Wow, not even one. Okay, that was completely not worth it. And there's public slavery. It cleared up and there's public slavery, which would have given us way more money. That's driving me nuts. Driving me nuts. Okay. Second war time. Now this is gonna put us at war with that guy, that guy, that guy, that dude, this dude, and that dude. And I'm okay with that. I really just want that, that, this stuff. I need some territory over here. Because right now, like that's, I got one province, or one, one territory out of the entire province, and one there. So I need these. And I'm 99% sure I have claims? Yeah. Because I have claims for those. This will finish that. Oh yeah, this. Yeah, we should take that. This is actually one whole state. I have nothing in this state. I could just leave that. And be perfectly fine. That I want to take. Alright, well, regardless, you are who we're going to take the most out of. Yeah, you're going to be the one that we take the most out of. You have the same allies, right? Yeah, that guy. That guy, that guy, it's just a big defensive alliance. Yeah. And, uh, which one is it? True, or we have let's... This one? Nope, this one. This is your biggest. Yeah. 
Not sure if it makes a difference, but we're just gonna assume it does. Let's see what it does, and we can't be wrong. You're going along. Damn it! Alright, well, this is what happens when I'm slow. Oh, and this guy. He's the governor of the province, so he's just gonna go and attack stuff? Okay. I accept your offer of attacking stuff. Oh, he's not loyal to me. That's why he's doing that. Ah, that's why he's doing that. You give someone an army when you're not loyal to them. You know, they just go wandering around. And hopefully he can win. Oh yeah, he's gonna win. He's fine. He's fine. Uh, you can come down here. Uh, and that is another one of those events. For the diplomatic thing that I'm doing right now. The mission up here. Uh, war. Yay. Sell. Yay. Money. Because apparently, 3% you know, of our manpower output is not very good. Or free man output is not very good. Alright, let's get down here. Get down here. Oh wait, this guy joined the war, didn't he? I thought one of the guys, somebody up here. No, I'm wrong. Nobody up there is at war with me. Okay. Well, that's good. Once I'm done up here, I just move everything down here. Don't have to worry about anything. Just siege a bunch of stuff. And this guy can just keep doing whatever he wants. He's, yeah. Oh, there's the enemy army. Go, go, destroy them. Go, go, gadget destruction. Okay, that's all done. Come down here. You can come over here. No, go over the... all the way over there. All the way to the far end. when it doesn't move. That keeps happening to me. Tell somebody to move somewhere and they start to and they immediately stop. For no apparent reason. And uh, yeah, there's my little governor. He's just gonna go and take a bunch of stuff. And whatever's in this region of Baitika, he would go and take, which is not much more. I think that's the last province. All the stuff here. This is all Baitika. Okay. Eventually here will run our stuff today. Eventually. One day. And, uh, oh, let's go over here. Let's go help our ally out. Although he might not need our help. He's probably fine. He's probably fine. Let's just go anyways, just in case. Make sure he's gonna- nope, he wasn't fine. Started out like he was gonna be okay, but it didn't end that way. He needs true Romans. Hmm. We need stability. We need stability. Omen. We need to keep getting that aggressive expansion down somehow. Down there. Ah, soldiers. Not nope, let them know how they do. It's fine. 
Uh, and for some reason, you also failed against this guy. And I'm probably gonna lose it. That's, uh... That's not good. I don't know why everyone's losing against this army. But yes, his, he's just a really good general, apparently. Uh, he defeated all my allies. And I think he's about to defeat this army as well. Yeah, that, that army is... Defeated. Okay. Well. That's unfortunate. But we just continue. We're, it's not gonna... Not gonna slow us down. Maybe slow us down a little bit. Not that much. Uh, barbarians, go destroy that barbarian horde. Don't let them raid us with their barbarianness. It must be destroyed. Ah, yes, excellent, excellent. Uh, and you, disgraceful. You could have lost the eagle a second time. Oh my god, I forgot about this eagle. How is this eagle still here? But I... He's my puppet. He's my puppet. How can my puppet have my eagle still? I conquered him. Alright, and we lost vegetables from here. That's not good. We need to not... Stop losing food. No secret. Stop losing food. The Maida's in Spina. Maybe they move on soon, maybe we'll do a blessing, or we can just send troops. I can afford 10,000. 10,000 manpower, yeah, we can do that. It's not a problem. And uh, we defeated those barbarians. Excellent news when barbarians are defeated. Uh, in this army, we're gonna send you over here because they're getting they're getting close to us over there. They're already gonna attack. Uh, which should be okay because the army leader here is actually strong. Yeah, he's a good leader. Good, good leader. That's good news. You don't have to go down there anymore. Killed 6,000 and we only lost 2. There, yeah, that's, that's vengeance. That is some good vengeance. Uh, and this guy died. Where is that? He was the leader of the Purple Legion. Do we have a young... No, we don't. We don't have anyone from my party that's young, which is unfortunate. Do we have somebody who's really old who will die soon? I don't have to worry about- yeah, oh yeah, my leader. We don't have to worry about my leader. He's gonna die- oh no, he's not dying. Ah, uh, well, shit. Oops. Oh well. Oh well, it's fine. This is going up a little bit. We gotta deal with your navy guy. And uh, yeah, now I, I just screwed myself with my leader. Hmm. Hmm, 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 hmm. Okay. I don't like that he's a head of a family and a thing of a jigger. Uh. Well. And I can't change that for another 12 months. That was a mistake. What a horrible, horrible mistake I've made. And there's no way to reverse it, so... We're just gonna have to deal with it this way. You go there. You go there. Oh, we... 
one both these sieges. Okay. Uh, you don't have to go there, apparently. Hmm. Is that an enemy? Oh, yeah, it is an enemy. Spirit. Oh, this is my leader. Leader, you need to go someplace not important. Go someplace where you won't get in a fight. Therefore, you won't be able to claim any victory or anything. And the troops won't like you. 18 years old and leading an army. You know what? We're gonna... Which, yeah. You know what? We're gonna keep you. Because we might be able to use you. We might be able to use that one. This guy, no. But you know what? I think I have to release her first. Otherwise, she won't, um... I mean, we might not be able to get her back. Okay, it's fine. We'll find out. We will find out one way or another. Alright, let's take this guy. So he has? Okay. Uh, that's one less enemy. Imprison the leaders. Make the rest disappear. You. We are going to do the same. Oh. Actually, we are going to take you for sure. I still don't know if I want this or not. How expensive are you going to be? Hmm. Six aggressive expansion. And when we take you over... Okay, stop that. You're going to be ten. Yeah, let's just take it. Let's just finish off this entire state. That's fine. Prison the leaders. Uh, this one. We will take both. And uh, imprison the leaders. Yeah, it's fine. Oh, I have a free one of these. That reminds me. Go home. Gets more buildings for free. And, uh, yeah. This could go either way. I think it's a good thing. I think it's a good thing. Uh, you... Don't need that. We do need that. And, uh, you know what? You don't need a fort. So, get rid of your fort. You don't need a fort there either anymore. Uh, this province won't need a fort any longer, pretty soon. And neither would this one. Start getting some money back. Yeah, you don't need a fort anymore. Why can't I? Oh, you're not loyal to me, so I can't even get rid of my forts. Hmm. Okay, that's fine. You're building that thing, right? Oh, you have a boat already. Oh. Is he... is that him? No, that's not him. What region are you? What region are you? Okay. Uh, are you? You're in this region. Okay. So we just gotta get him. Another archer, another infantry. And maybe that'll help out a little bit more. Possibly. Overall. Yeah, we'll go with it. Maybe it'll help him a little bit. Alright, back to this war. You also really need a little army up here, aren't you? Yeah. Let's build you a little army as well. And uh, unfortunately, these guys are starting to get overwhelmed by their other enemies. And these guys are getting all overwhelmed by other enemies. What is going on? So much overwhelmingness. Just 
everywhere. People getting conquered by other people. Spain is a mess. Ah, there's that little army uh, assigned to region and... Oh, he's not loyal to me, is he? Wow. Okay. Well, he's a dick. Bribe him. <laughs> yes, bribe him. So I can give him an army. What could go wrong? We've given a governor an army who you have to bribe just to give him troops. Uh, in this state here, you have negative food. Why? Why do you have negative food? What do you need? Livestock? Livestock it is. Stop being so negative on food. We burned the witches. Oh, we banned the witches so that you can have food. And you're telling me you have no food. Just a bitter disappointment constantly. Alright, this can go here. You can go over here. Hopefully we can take this entire state. Don't really need this one. I think this one we won't take. And uh, you guys are just gonna get conquered just because. Why did you stop? <laughs> Again, this game keeps doing this with my armies. They just randomly stop for no reason. Uh, oh, we're done this thing. Alright. First, we got the Northern Lands. Just gonna give us population assimilation speed at the cost of happiness. But it's only really gonna do it for this right here. Just my territory that's actually here. Uh, and they don't actually need anything. Wow. Well, I guess the, the assimilation speed does help a little bit. It's fine. It's only for five years. It's not that bad. And, uh, oh, uh, obviously Pisa is going to be the capital. Naturally. We had this as the capital for such a long time, but there's just no point. Pisa is clearly the capital. And is deserving of more taxes. Then, the Pedas Valley. It's gonna give us a Colonia, uh, and that's it. Really? That's it? Just a Colonia. Oh, and it gives us claim to uh, a many. Where does it give us a claim? It just gives us a claim here. Okay, well, whatever. And, uh, Spinia? Spinia. Do you have a city already? You don't have a city. Oh, and you have fish. Uh, I don't think you can have fish in a city for some stupid reason. So that might not be a good idea. Yeah, cities don't usually have fish, apparently. I don't know. Maybe it's a Roman thing. We don't have fish in cities. Uh, so Bonia. Bonia is already a city. Parma. Let's make, uh, yeah, let's make Parma. Hummer would become a city and up to three people would become Roman which is great that's that's half the population potentially yeah three Romans oh there's a lot of Romans okay and what else is next on this on this epic adventure we ought to take uh, the rest of that Italian feudatories I already took all of these, so nothing's gonna happen there, uh, and nothing's gonna happen there. So it's just this. We gotta fight a war against this guy and take over his stuff. And I think, do 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 do, vanquish. I don't know if that means he has to actually be gone in order for me to get this mission done, or if he can be. My puppet. I thought he could be my puppet. Uh, and this guy. This guy should already be complete. Yeah, this guy's gonna be already completed. 
Oh no, I have to take that. And Roman settles, move in. And then there's some good stuff that happens after that. Yeah, good stuff happens. Okay, so that'll be next. Once we're done in Spain, we'll go over there and apparently invade this guy. Do I, though? Oh, somebody declared war on somebody? Oh, there's a rebellion. I've assumed leadership to fight the rebels. Over here somewhere? Over here somewhere? Where? Here? Uh, there's bubbles somewhere. All the way over here? Really? Okay. Okay. Bubbles are way over there. We gotta go fight them. I think we just take a couple of armies right now, actually. Can we get our ships? Uh, meet there. These two armies, yeah, come over here. Meet here. Uh, he's sieging, but really, this will be over before he finishes that siege. I'd imagine. I don't know. Send this guy over here just in case. And some. Oh, yeah, the religious dude died. The religious dude who is really, really, really ancient. And here's another religious guy who's also ancient. The ancients are, are religious people. Oh, and I forgot. We have a bunch of these people. So, we can actually. Release. Release. All these people that are. He's actually pretty good. He's got 10 military. Anyway, you sell into slavery. You sell into slavery. Release. Release. Sell into slavery. Release. No, I think the old people, they should be at a certain age where I should not be releasing them into the population. Power base is zero. Uh, you're 39. You are 56 years old, but you kind of have some good stats. So you know what? We'll keep them. Uh, ancient and of the wrong party. Uh, ancient. 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 Mm, 42. Yeah, you can live a little bit longer. I'm gonna do some use. Uh, 58 ancient. 58 is ancient in this game. <laughs> Although, considering some leaders seem to be, you know, living forever. Uh, can't do anything with you, can't do anything with you, can't do anything with you, right? No. We never got that guy back. That's a shame. Oh, that girl back. The, the young one that was 18 that had like 9 military. It's unfortunate, I really wanted to imprison her and actually uh, free her and make her Roman and have her lead my armies to victory. And none of that will happen. All because of this game. It's all the game's fault. Uh, oh! Ex-slave family emergency emerges. Hmm. Interesting, interesting, interesting. This is interesting. This dude. But this dude, unfortunately, no, he should be a popular populace. Why isn't he one of us? Why is he support the money? He should be one of us. Former slave plus 20, so he might actually 
always have that bonus. He might one day become our party member, I guess. Hmm. I mean, my leader loses popularity. I don't care about that. He becomes a new family. He might be you become one of our parties, so that that's not bad. And I get a lot of money. I didn't pull off my party. But I lose stability. That's the only negative. You know what? Let's do it. I will take that. Uh, except his family has nobody in a party, really. Everybody is scorned by this. Hmm, interesting. Oh no, what's really interesting is the youngster is a former slave. But the head of the party is not. He's some 75 year old guy. Interesting, interesting. That's, uh, that's interesting. Okay. Uh, hey, that evil first guy. Where's that guy that was April 1st? One of you, April 1st. Yep. Uh, let's make him... Oh, look at that. 21 years old. 21 years old. This guy's 19. These are good military commanders. Except his loyalty really sucks. Your your loyalty sucks, buddy. But you. I think he's at my party. That's the most important thing. Are you gonna stay as my party? Yeah, you will. Yeah. He's gonna be a party member forever. Uh, what about the rest of his family though? Because he had some more good military people here. Like this guy, 11. Are you gonna join my party at some point? Hey, you might. Yeah, you would. Hey, you know what? This guy will eventually join the military party. Or the popular party. Because, uh, yeah, he's, he's good for that. Okay. And he's young, he's only like 16. That's, that's good. It's bonus. Server Legion, you. Uh, are you ever going to revert to us? No, never. You always gonna be that crappy? Okay. Let's change him. Uh, to the 19 year old who will one day become a member of our party. It's inevitable. Plus 16. It's inevitable. He's gonna be a member of our party eventually. Commanded cohorts. Oh, yeah. That's fantastic. And you can just continue doing the thing. And you can continue doing the thing. Now I have to figure out two more places for that part for his home. You know, if I had the money, I would build two new armies just for those guys. But I don't have the money. That's unfortunate. Alright, let's get these armies. All the way over here in Greece. To fight the rebels. The rebels. Uh, and this war is done. This war is done. Let's take our thing. We wanted that. We wanted that. We wanted that. And that puts us at uh, 55. Okay, well that's gonna suck. Uh, yeah, we do, we do want all that, okay. I mean, preferably we take that as well. That's gonna give us 17, that's too much. Just reset it. Give me that, that. These do have 50. I do have full claims on this. Yes. You are fully claimed. No, you're not. Yes, you are. And you... 
button fully claimed as well, yes. And it's still giving me 12. 12 aggressive expansion. It's gonna put me over 55, which gives me severe penalties. For probably a few years. Uh, oh, ye. Ah, tough choice. Tough choice. Let's see. That brings me down to 10. 9. Still 9. 8. Come on. 7. 7. Alright. We'll take it. It's not perfect. It puts us right at 50. Oh, there's a, a brief look of those severe penalties. Claim fabrication. Uh, I think that that's different. Monthly stability is the same. Loyalty is the same. Integrated is the same. Uh, but the monthly political influence and the claim fabrication is new. And that's the severe penalties? And negative impact on other nations' opinion of us. How negative? How much do you hate me because I'm aggressive? 85? Cats? Is that standard for everybody or is that just kind of... No, that's just kind of because I'm aggressive. Hmm. Okay, whatever. It's fine. It's cool. It's cool. cool, 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 cool. Uh, you can go back into our territory. You guys make your way in, and then come over here. Yeah, that works. That works, right? Okay, what do we got? So, this stayed the same. You expanded a bit, uh, and have a shitty policy there. That's that's great. Be harsh. Didn't help very much. It's okay, we'll figure that out later. You grew quite a bit. Oh yeah, that was a growth for you. You grew, which is good. You took new territory, which for some reason is on the very loyal to us. I'm not sure why. Very loyal for some reason. Now you... I think we're gonna give him an army. Just a small little detachment. Oh, I forgot about the money. I forgot I got a lot more money. Hmm. What am I gonna do for money? We gotta spend that money. Actually, first of all. Do we have this? No, we didn't take anything. Um, fort. I don't need a second fort here. I can't get rid of stuff. I forgot. I forgot I can't build. Destroy. Province. That's not loyal to me. You're fine. You. We don't need that. Build more Let's take this. You don't really have that. Um, you don't need that. For a lot of citizens, no, no citizens. Oh, oh, tax. No, no. That didn't work. Tax. Now you. You don't need this fort. I'm literally right beside you. Uh, you guys are not loyal, so I can't get rid of your fort. It's unfortunate, and there's no cities around here. There's a city. It's already got a bunch of stuff in it to convert. Yeah, we'll leave 
with that for now. We'll leave. No, I don't need this one here. That's my own. That's my puppet. He's not gonna do anything. Uh, I should put a fort up here though. In this port. Oh, that reminds me. This fort. This port also needs a fort. Uh, this port will definitely have tribal settlements. Oh. I forgot about tribal settlements. There's gonna be a lot of those everywhere, aren't they? Oh, yeah. Yeah, no, we wanna get rid of that junk. That junk does not exist in Rome. We don't want tribal settlements in Roman territory. The tribes do nothing really. Nothing good for me. They just get all finicky and fussy. Whenever we try to civilize them. I completely forgot. I gotta check like every single province. This is gonna take a little while and I apologize for that. This has been a whole game that I have not been getting rid of those things. So much wasted money. What is that? What is that? What is that? I've never seen that. What? When did this become a thing? Hold on. No. Really? Hmm. Is that all it does? Does it change, uh... Does it change any of this? Sixteen percent. And normally it's like eleven. No, normally it's zero. What is it? It's still zero. Okay. It just increases the simulation slightly more. Oh, well, we'll leave it for now. I'm not happy I just realized that. Uh, da, 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 da. No, no, no tribes. No, no more tribes. Seriously, no more tribes. This is not a tribe of Rome. This is the empire of Rome. We are civilized here. Okay, this one. Did I check this one? Yeah, I checked that one. Yeah, we got to um I'm gonna change the view here. Province view. There we go. Yeah, that should make it a little bit easier for me. Different colors makes it easier to see what I've done already sometimes. Sometimes colors. Just sometimes. Okay, is there a different one I can do? No, nope, they're really easy. Okay. This will just have to be this way. There's gonna be tribes everywhere. In all of my territory. And it is just gonna be brutal. Gonna get a lot of money back though. Micromanaging. Yes, 
Yes, I am. <laughs> this is going to be like the next 15 minutes. Uh, unless I can find an easier way. Holdings. Uh, I don't understand this view at all. Oh, holdings. No, I, I know that one. Oh, I'm always good. Uh, I'm always... Oops, I got rid of that thing. Uh, I need to find a way to see a very specific building. And I don't think there is a way to do it, unfortunately. Uh, bring back my dip diplomatic nap mode. Bring that back. Uh, population, symbol, region. Uh, bring me my regions. That'll help me a little bit. And there isn't, unfortunately. Well. Uh, this did not help as much as it helped. Okay. This is gonna be awful. I gotta get rid of all the barbarian tribes. We don't need barbarian tribes in Rome. But that does mean a lot of clicking. And I'm actually surprised there's not as many as I thought there was gonna be. Did I do this province? I don't know if I did. I was expecting more. I did the pink one, I know for sure. Oh, but this blue one. Nope, nothing there. Alright, green. This green. Yeah, I'm really, I'm surprised I'm not seeing very many of these tribes. This is, uh, oddly... It's odd, usually there's like hundreds of them. You just find them everywhere, and it's a very painful experience. Okay, Spain did not have that many. Uh, do I even want to go through Carthage's whole territories? I probably should. Odd. Usually the AI builds like hundreds of these things everywhere. Oh, there's one. Finally. Jesus. <laughs> Took a while just to find one. There's another one. I knew Carthage was full of barbarians. Apparently they're more barbaric than the Spaniards. I didn't remember. Yeah. 
Hey, right, we got purple, we go down this direction. Really need to fix my money. Maybe this will help. Help get rid of some of the barbarians. All these tribesmen. Make us a little money on the side. Well, it's not making me much money on the side right now. Oh, jeez. Alright, well, Carthage did not have as many barbarians as I thought. Uh, oh, I forgot about these islands. There were barbarians on these islands for a long time. Apparently, nope, not that much either. Uh, we have some stuff up here. But I don't, I think this is mostly fortifications. Yeah, no, nope, not much there. Let's go through my island. Through the island. Alright, well, Carthage were not as many barbarians as I thought, apparently. Too much in Italy, but I should see some. I have definitely nothing in Rome. <laughs> that place was debarbarianized at some point. Thoroughly debarbarianized. left is the actual barbarian horde territory that I recently took and there should be a ton in here. Oh, I just passed one. No, that wasn't one. And uh, you know what? There's not many up here either. That's very odd. Even the barbarians were trying to be more civil. Oh, this one. Nope, oh, those two. Oh, there's three. And that's my ally. Alright, well, that was nowhere near as many as I thought I was going to have. And it did not make me as much money as I was hoping for. Okay. Well, next part of this is to get some buildings down. Actually do some building. Isn't that amazing? We need to build some stuff. You know, I really need taxes. We're just gonna focus on taxes. We're just gonna tax everybody everywhere. The name of this game is now Taxation. Tax, 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 tax. Gotta get my tax money. Yep, more taxes for you. More tax 
boxes for you. Is there a shortcut? You know, oh, you know what? There is actually. This would be a good time to do this. Yeah. Gotta paint. Oh, I'm running out of money. That went by fast. Alright, that went a lot faster. <laughs> that was more efficient. And I'm out of money though. But that's okay. We just get some event. That tells me how bad I am. And it will give me money. Uh, this guy's already doing that. That's fine. I mean, this guy, come on, I, you have an army. I've given you a, a decent sized army to make your population loyal. And you all continue to fail me at this task. Hmm. I don't know what I'm going to do with these guys. I'm going to have to work on that some. Uh, happiness, omen, population, great. All stuff that does not happen. Help me. For I have no money. Uh, Roman Legion, you. We are going to assign to this Legion, to this area. Wearing indeed research points. Yeah, I don't care about research points. I'll take that. That's good. That's good. Uh, where? Are we going to do the most good with the money, though? National Slave Output. Oh, that's going to bring my money straight down. National Slave Output. Slaves make us money for some reason. And that is just what's going to have to work for us. And hopefully, if we assign this to the region, hopefully that'll fix it a little bit in a little bit of time. Uh, you are not being fixed up. Really, I just gotta get my aggressive expansion fixed. Hmm. Oh, I forgot about that. Uh, where's my fleet? How's my fleet doing? How are the troops in that fleet? Hey, yeah, lots of food. They got lots of food. Just go straight to the enemy. Oh, oh dear. This is way out of our range. Well, either way, just go straight to the enemy. And retake it in the name of a Greek ally, who apparently only has one troop. Oh, two more over there. And no ships. No ships, really? No, you have seven ships and 16 troops. Oh, I think his troops are helping me. Oh well. Oh well. And I just saw all my tax offices get built. There's a whole greenery of tax offices. It's fantastic. And I'm still losing money. How? I upgraded my slave output. I got more taxes in my main states. And still, this game hates me. back over here into a port. Yeah, I think we do. How big, uh, how much money am I spending on the navy? Quite a bit of money. I do need the big navy though. Fort maintenance is 60. It's those, the paying people part. Paying people money is not good. Oh no. Oh, him. 
20 loyalty. I mean, he's gonna die eventually. He is rapidly dying from inflammation. Uh, but even so, I'll make good use of that money. Don't worry. What kind of inventions can we afford? <laughs> just, just immediately spend it. Uh, state happiness. Loyalty of generals would be good. Ashore tribesman output is completely useless. Citizen output's not going to help us with money. Subject opinion on last night, I don't need that. I mean, I kind of want the general loyalty, but then I'm going to lose money again. And I, there are some pretty bad events. But there's some not so bad events, like the one I just encountered, and the one before it. So you know what we're going to do? We're going to do. We're going to make our generals loyal. That extra five loyalty for the generals will surely come in handy someday. I'm sure of it. Positive of it. Oh my god, he's got 81 happiness or loyalty. <laughs> and he's a scorned family? Wow. Wow. Good for that guy. And yeah. I need to find something for those, those scorned families. I need people to die and make room for the scorned families. No, yeah, maybe what we do. Uh, Claudia family and the Kalupi family. Be, he's got 6 out of 4, so I can get rid of one of him, and he's got 5 out of 4, so I can get one over him. That works. That works. Where did the technology go? This guy. You can get replaced by this 18 year old who apparently is better at the job than you. Oh, actually, 76 year old. Oh, no, he's a different party. No, do it. And uh, this guy can get replaced. Uh, that's unfortunate. Um, I mean, it's not what he's good at, but at least it's uh, the correct party. And that reminds me how. Okay, the console of War Rome does not have as much. Uh, Gabini family is that new family. He's the head of it. Oh. I mean, he's old. He's gonna die eventually. Probably pretty soon. His children, his child would take over. And he is a member of our party, so that's, that's good. Yeah, it's good. That works for me. And that Admiral... My Admiral will die soon, right? How old is this guy? Come on. He's, he's got uh, gout. And he's 83 years old. He's only got 13 months to live. At most. Oh, 14 months because of that 0.8%. So if he doesn't die from old age, <laughs> he'll die from the gout. Good news, for, good news for Rome. Uh, and that one's done. You can't help out or anything. Okay. Uh, what about you? You're at Rome war. Okay. Oh, Egypt and Antigone are still at war? Or is this another war? I think it's a new war. Oh yeah, that's a new war. They haven't been fighting all this time. They started the game at war, and they are back at war again. So it's good to know. 
Uh, and these guys, where are my armies? Are they making their way here? Oh, they're here. Uh, well, shit. Get the navy. We're gonna recover our other two armies later. Get the navy over here. Uh, actually, this province cannot support us. Okay, no problem, can support us. That's fine. In the name of No, I don't want to stay. It's not going to be much longer. Some patience. Patience is a virtue. Oh, interesting. Tiberius is sick. He's a governor of something. I don't. Why is Tiberius? Why is this interesting exactly? Arthritis. He, he's got arthritis. He's old, he has arthritis, and he's not at all important, apparently. I don't know why it's important. <laughs> uh, what could go wrong? Sign him up. Whose army is this, though? Where? Ah, uh, yeah, sign them up. Let's see, where is it? Where is his legion? Nope. Oh, why is he the XI legion? He should have a name. He should have a cool name like everybody else. Uh, he is the... What am I missing? I got red, blue, purple, silver, green. Green legion. Uh, and this guy. Why is your army here? Wait, who is this guy exactly? Why does he have an army in Rome? I don't know why this guy has an army. In Rome. Did I get free stuff? No, I didn't. No free stuff. But... Even though I didn't get free stuff, I think... Oh, you already have one. Wow. You're still in the negative? I can't help you. Minus five... Do, do, do. Alright, who's the most negative? You have minus three, you're not that bad. You have minus eight. And you already have one, so I can't even afford you right now. Uh, you're gonna be minus five, you're minus eight. It's not gonna help. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, that'll break you even. That'll break him even. That's good to know. Uh, oh, in this war. Uh, what can I do here? Transfer. Just transfer back to my ally, I guess. I don't know what I actually have to do. Um, it's great that there's a battle that does not involve me in any way, shape, or form. Can I click on my friends? There we go. think. There we go, that works. And so ends that civil war. Characters in the fallen. Okay, the Fabi family has fallen. Oh, because I had too many great families. 
Uh, who who were the family family? Did they have anything important? I don't think they did. I think the Fabi. Oh, the Fabi had a bunch of stuff that was important. Ah, ah they had a bunch of guys. Ah, shite. Ah, that's unfortunate. All right, probably in horde time. Who are you allied with? Are you allied with anyone? Important? Not really. Cool defensive alliances with unimportant people as well. And allied with that guy who's not very. Oh, I have claims on him. Yeah, I got claims on him. I got claims for this territory on him. That's good news. I'll take half. And, uh, Masilla can take the other half. I have no claim. Oh no. Oh no. Uh, him. So failing that, I'm gonna war with this guy. If I go to war with this guy, uh, he doesn't join? Oh, he does join, there he is. And it's all these other southern guys. Now the thing is... The thing is... Oh, they're transport goal. But... Hmm... How can I do this? In a way that I don't take too much aggressive expansion. Alright, get the armies up here. We'll figure it out on the job. Uh, in fact, I'm not going to actually wait for the army to show up. Parma. Oh yeah, that city. Uh, yeah, we're not going to wait for the armies to show up. We're going to just... My allies are already moving back. Maybe I will make for the armies to show up a little bit. Let's wait for this dead event. And then maybe we'll do something. Let our armies get a little bit closer. <laughs> Alright, so we'll let our ally take this. Oh, is there still any no more barbarians around here either? Wow. Alright, ally takes that. Takes this half. Maybe a little bit helps. It does. And... Oh, there's my military equipment. Damn it. Five years. Alright, well, that's unfortunate. I do need more taxes, though. To help us make more money, we need more taxes. Carthage, we need to be taxed more. This one, this one, this one, this one. 
and we'll get hit by an event pretty soon that will be similarly bad and we would just take it we we'll just take it on the chin we we'll just take the negative publicity and we'll go with it and this one goes here Arrived, they can come straight up here. Oh, and finally, he has died. That is good news. Now the question is. Who do you now have that's important? Oh, but the, the Navy didn't actually harm his thing. So summoning somebody to the Navy does not matter. It can be anyone. As long as they're not, uh, they don't have a power base. Well, that's the thing, we don't want them to have a power base. Hmm. Well, this guy. This guy's young. He's not that bad. He's part of a party. Party for life, right? Party for life. Party on, rain. Uh, that didn't turn out the way I hoped. Yeah, you gotta come down here. The Red Legion. Oh, that's that's unfortunate. Oh, and he's in a siege. Um, well, I really could have used that young guy now, <laughs> who was a member of my party. That's unfortunate. Wow, nobody, nobody, nobody at all. Uh, I can't change him out. And you're no good. I need to change somebody out. This guy, are you loyal? No, you're not. What up here? Nope. Good sir. I'm gonna have to be replaced. Oh, what's your army? Four? Yeah, that's not that bad. I'll take that. I will take that. And who can we throw? Who has a power base? You have a power base of two. Oh, you. You have a power base of 21. Oh, you're old and dying as well. Uh, and you have a power base of four, and actually, you're young, and you're a scorn family, so we'll do that. And I still have a scorn family. Wow. I guess they're from the same family. Uh, and he wasn't a good leader, but he is our party, and he's our party for life. It's a lifer. Why are none of my allies' armies like sieging? <gasps> That's a great gift. That's a fantastic gift from the gods, of course. And none of this is going to help me with money again. Nothing helps me with money. Because I don't get any tribute from anyone, so. Where's my. Where's my. Where's my. Where's my. 
this thing? No, this thing. Get some more tax offices. Let's tax the people some more. And the hopes that that will make my money positive. Almost not that much tax anymore. Hmm. The one more place is the tax. Oh, find more. And uh, these places are already almost done. Hopefully, no, that's going to do nothing for my money. <laughs> uh, it hurts sometimes. This game just hurts sometimes. Alright, siege, siege, siege. Why can't you move in siege? Ugh, oh, take that. Really? Yeah. Give him a thousand. But this guy is. I mean, he is a member of my party, but he's never gonna have kids or anything like that, so. That money's wasted on him. Give him a thousand gold, it would go nowhere. I might as well get my share. Oops. That's yes. not what I wanted. Uh, okay. Sir, can go all the way over. Progress. And hopefully my allies were siege these at some point. That'd be nice. Stop running around with chickens of your heads cut off and actually siege something. Macedon, uh, what are we going to do with you? Every day I ask myself this. Every time I look at you, Macedon, I think, how could you possibly get bigger? And then you get bigger. Every time. Continue sieging the enemy territory. Are we down to 36 aggressive expansion? Not bad, not bad. Go get him. Yeah, you know, Jungle Boy, I uh, I still have some PTSD from the last time I fought war with them. <laughs> So it, it's always one of those things, it's like, ah, oh, what do I do with them? 
Use of ten popularity. Oh, I won't do that. The last time I fought them, I outnumbered them, but they kept my they kept attacking me when my armies were separate. And they had the, this big giant stack of 20 troops and I only had two stacks of 12. And yeah, he just kept attacking when they were separated. And he kept winning every time. And I always took terrain penalties and uh, just any penalty you can think of. I took it. Every single battle. Didn't matter if it was offensive, defensive, didn't matter. They always had the advantage. And uh, even when I had both stacks together, he still defeated them. And I was like, well, that's done. And then I ended up white piecing him. I was lucky enough. Oh no! It was a, um. It was the forced white piece. Oh, we made it close to the forced white piece. We had the forced white piece, which is a little thing that shows up here saying you have a thousand days to either conquer them or it's a white piece war, essentially. Uh, take the claim that you're supposed to take and we got about halfway through and he offered me a white piece and I was like okay done taking it <laughs> and then I went in a fight a giant war against Carthage and uh, almost lost that because of it so I much lacked manpower I could barely fight it so is he fighting a civil war? No, he's fine. It's a little bit of PTSD from that damn thing. Okay, we took that one, we took that one. I don't know what's left. This, this part. Where's this for? I think it's for. But I'm running out of stuff to conquer. And uh, I really do have to curb him. And actually even this little guy right here, my puppet that I just took today. Uh, this used to be only his territory. Before I made him my puppet. So, if I do go to war with Macedonia, I'll be able to let him take a bunch of territory back. Uh, I'll even, I mean, by the time I fight a big enough war of him, I should actually have, like, no aggressive expansion at that point. By the time I invaded him, for the most part, and just destroyed everything. It would take a very, very long time to do it. It's basically the next stream, <laughs> you know, it'll be a four hour stream of War of Macedonia. <laughs> and it might not even finish, <laughs> that's how big it'll be. <laughs> four hours might not be enough. Uh, these guys, let's put that, the head of that family. Uh, this guy with 21 power base. Yeah, let's put him in charge. Doesn't matter if he dies soon or not. It would just be good to um, get him his influence gone. And hopefully they just kind of drop steadily. And hopefully he would drop steadily. We gotta really figure out a way to make good progress with these guys. And I think the only way to do it is to have an actual ruler with them. And uh, it's it's not working out very quickly. They don't have any good leaders. We're losing food. The purple legion has no food. It's a good thing he's no longer in a siege, but he needs food. Uh, this guy is done for, right? Nope. Oh, that one's done. Uh, uh, is my ally gonna come and help me? Yeah, he's going there. 
need help. Oh, but I like the, those odds changed out of my favor somehow at the last minute. Uh, but you know what? It looks like a good fight. I should be... Uh, yeah, it looks like I want it. I want it. It's good. Go! Oh, what's that? Oh, my claim came in. That's good timing. Uh, and this guy. He was a governor. He was a governor. Who? Camilius Claudius. Who is Camilius Claudius? No, it actually didn't really say who he was. Look down. He's a Tribunus Clevis. Okay. This guy. 54 years old, is he gonna die anytime soon? Um, not really. You would watch the hell out of me messing up Macedonia or getting messed up. <laughs> Which would you prefer? Me getting messed up by them or me messing them up? There is a difference. These guys. Do, 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 do. No, there's no one really good here, actually. Except for this guy. This guy has no power base, but he wouldn't be good for us at all. Uh, power base. He's got low codes. Now, you know what? Let's find somebody. One of these guys. Power base of two, zero. Zero, 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 zero. Somebody's gonna have more power base than the two. Come on. Apparently not. Hey, Mr. Fabius. Me messing them up. Oh, okay. I know, either way, it could be an interesting stream. It's either me yelling and screaming and going in terror and. <laughs> or me. Yelling and screaming victory. It can go either way. Who's the arthritis trait? No, who lost the arthritis trait? Hold on. Oh my guy? Oh, okay, yeah, he's, he can live. That's good. Ten thousand troops dead. Oh, we captured a bunch. Set up slavery. Set up slavery. My money is still, still in the negative. Did all those things get built yet? They did. All those tax offices got built, and I'm still in the negative. This is truly hurting me. And yeah. you know what? Because yeah, our next stream is gonna be me fighting these guys. It's it's time. Oh look, a rebellion. Yeah. Um, it's definitely time. It's doomed to fail. Tiny little doomed to fail rebellion. <laughs> so that'll be next time. So then I don't need the aggressive expansion because it'll it'll be a very long war. So I might as well get the national commerce and actually fix my 
get a positive number for once. So I definitely don't want to get a negative number and have more military moral damage because of it. Right in the middle of a war. Would not be a good thing. Oh, this thing is still being sieged. Oh, that's what's taking so long. Okay. Just start moving my armies this way. That's why we're not done yet. There we go. Okay. So, we want... I don't want this for myself. We're gonna give this to my ally. Uh, the, what, which ally is this? Um, this one. Yeah. I'm gonna give it to him. So that I don't take the penalty. And so that I don't have to deal with the territory. And he's already got stuff in there, so that's fine. Right there, that button. That button, and uh. Keep missing it. Keep scrolling past the button that I need. Right. So he can have all that. That's the first. Then, what's my plan for these guys? Probably want to do this. Who's the main main guy? You're the main guy. Yeah. So this guy's first. I'm gonna take his stuff from me. So I already have stuff there. So it's all in a corner that I have. Actually, that means we can get rid of some of these forts. Get rid of that fort. Don't really need this fort anymore. Uh, don't really need this fort. Keep one fort just in case. I don't need it anymore. Hey, yeah, get rid of it. Uh, this guy. I want. Province is that? That's probably this province. I don't know what to do with this province. I don't know if I want that or not. We'll just. It's not good to give to my allies. I don't really want it for myself. Maybe I do give it to my. Maybe I give it to this guy. No, it takes him out of the out of the state. Out of the region. It's a different region for him. How about you? No, you have the same region. Uh, tough choice. Um, 10 aggressive expansion. I don't want to take 10 aggressive expansion though. Oh dear. No, we're gonna do it. I take it. Have a nice fort there. Don't really need. I guess we'll build a fort there for now. Uh, this is a nice little city. Let's romanize it a little bit. Does he have two forts there? He just has one. Ah, he's got an aqueduct. He doesn't need an aqueduct. He needs a camp. Uh, and then we do have too many forts here. You can go away. Uh, you. Okay. Aggressive. It is kind of aggressive. But, um, we got time. We got time to fix stuff. Now, this guy. We're gonna give half to the ally in his territory as well, so he can take half of it. And uh, actually, is this in uh, the same? Yes, it is. 
Oh, that's perfect. That is perfect. We're gonna give that to him as well. We can have that. We are we have cruising here. We have that. And uh, you know what? I'll even let him take half of this. Do I even need any of it? You got wheat, you got salt. I mean food is good. Yeah, food is very good. I'll take these two and I'll give them the other two. You can have one food, I'll keep one food. Yeah, that works. Let's let's give him We'll give him more than half of that. And uh, again, this is Transplane Goal. Basically, if you, if you don't, you probably know. You might know. You might not know. Um, so because it, it's Transplane Goal, he gets the same governor basically for all of it, which I believe is his ruler. So as long as you keep stuff within Transplane Goal alongside with him, uh, he stays more stable, essentially. Whereas if you went outside of it, into a different region, he'd have to appoint a new governor there. And that governor might not be as loyal as himself. <laughs> it's probably more loyal to himself than uh, some governor would be to him. So that's why it's kind of important to keep them in there. And you know what? I think... If I let him take most of this state right here, and I take just that here, I can still expand out. And it keeps my aggressive expansion down nicely. How much is that going to cost me? That's going to cost me three. That's going to put me right to the edge. Which makes it hard for me to take even this, those two. Oh, I forgot this guy had a thing here. Was he at war with me? Oh, he was. The guy that I just conquered over here, he had this little province over here. I didn't even notice it. Okay. 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 That's cool. Cool, cool. So at least one except survived. So it doesn't really matter if I live, let a couple more live. Right? No, that's wrong. They all need to perish. No, it's fine. We'll just change you to him. You can go to him. You can go to him. Whoops. Uh, you can go to him. Hmm. Horses. Sheep. Mobile. What do we already have? We already have sheep. Yeah, so I don't need the horses, that's fine. You can have the horses. And uh, I don't want to let him have the entire province here. Oh, there's a temple. It gives a uh, plus 10 commerce value for this region. Uh, so that needs to definitely come to me. And this is just a settlement. It's a farming community and it's got livestock. So I kind of want it as well. Alright, let's see. Okay, give me my thing. You can have that, you can have that, I'm gonna take that. And that's gonna give me... It's not all me, nine. It gives him two and three. You know, any part of that. Okay, it's gonna put me a little bit over. It's not actually giving me nine. Yeah, see, that's not that bad. Alright, prison. 
That's not that bad. Just a tiny bit over. It'll be away in a month. I'll be back under. There you go. Wait a minute. Time changed. Under the 50 point mark. That's good. We'll leave this fort attached. Just to protect that nice shrine that gives me 10 commerce value. Uh, that can stay the same over here. We took some stuff. Um, keep this fort here. Keep the fort there. Get rid of this fort. This fort is in there. Oh, and the sheep. Oh, those poor sheep. Why are they minus 15% for looted? Oh, they just had a lot of population there for some reason. Okay, that's fine. That is fine. The province, food overall, hopefully is okay. Dysteria. Oh, yes. Die, you, you damn bastard leader. Die. Minus 0.50. Uh, what is that? 120 months? 100, oh, 122 months. That's only uh, 10 years. 10 years here to <laughs> Is Am I getting that right? Yeah, 10 years. 120 months, 12 months in a year. 10 years before he dies. Okay. I can live with that. Oh, and we get, uh, we get to finish this thing. Okay. Rome or fortified territory. I already fortified everything. This, this really... This does not need to be fortified further. And I'm going to lose a farming settlement and gain a fortress that I'm probably going to destroy immediately. And where is this? It's right there, isn't it? Yep. That's unfortunate. That's great. Game, give me a free thing that I don't want. Uh, rebuild my farming settlement, actually. Because I just lost the grain from that. That's great. That's great. I appreciate that. Okay. And we do get this, even though he's still alive. That's good. Uh, population assimilation speed 15% for 60 months. That's pretty good. I'll take that. And we will establish a colonia. Do I want another city? No, it's fish. I don't want to lose that. Uh, I guess we just keep it at the same place. Gives us a bonus assimilation speed for that place, and up to 10 population becomes Roman, and we might get four free Roman freemen. That's pretty good. It's a. Uh, oh, population went above and beyond what it's supposed to be. But the good news is we got 15 moments there now. That's pretty good. Then, we got this province here. Uh, get my phone here. Now, where are some of these places? Uh, Novara is right there. Do, 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 do. Who's going to give me a lot of population? Who's going to give me a city? Uh, Tikanum is right there. Nobem is there. Where is the other two? You know what? The other two don't matter. I can't find them. I don't see them on here right away. Uh, let's go. We don't want to use vegetables. Hemp, hemp. Vegetables. I don't want to lose vegetables. I'm okay with losing hemp. Where's this? Oh, where's uh, that place? Uh, they're all nearby each other. Let's go there. Well, that's going to become a city in two years. And this is a 180 day event that will have Romans settle throughout this area. Which would be good for us. Alright. Let's at least prepare a little bit. 
to fight this war against uh, Macedon. I need more armies. That's the one thing with Macedon is I'm gonna need more armies than just where's my fifth army? There it is. I'm gonna need more than five. And I don't have enough of a balance for that. Hmm. I think you have to be a little bit defensive against him at first. Let him send his armies in and clash against us. And take heavy casualties. And then we start being aggressive. But we'll figure that out next time. For now, let's just get this event done. And we can finish this mission. I definitely won't make the same mistake I made last time and try to launch a naval invasion. That did not end well. It's definitely not something- oh, I forgot about these guys. Oh, I don't want Carthage to just- or Wow, I'm already calling him Carthage. I don't want Macedon to just send his entire army down here and slaughter my ally. And I know I'll have other allies that will try to help him. But that is why I picked him. So that he can be a distraction. So one way or another, either Macedon sends a bunch of troops up here to fight me, or and then he just kind of slowly takes stuff. Or Macedon will send all his armies down here, and I would be able to rapidly take a bunch of stuff. And try to hurt him a little. But I think it's better. I hope he actually comes and fights me. Because that way he kind of... I don't have to worry about liberating him later. Macedon can just come and fight me directly. That would be better. Ah, there we go. 33 Roman. As I open it, the event finishes. With the conquest of such a large area, blah, blah, blah. 33, 30 Roman freemen have moved to owned territories in the region of uh, Caspia Gaul. Cas... I don't know how to pronounce it. I'm sorry. <laughs> Got a bunch of free people there. They're Romans. That's what counts. And uh, to finish, let's see, we're going to get two free uh, Provincia investments, and we get the impressive arc in Roma. Roma gets impressive arc. Integrated culture happiness plus 5%. And a choice of policy. I don't really need the impressive arc, because the only integrated population I have is Romans, and they're not integrated, they're core. So that does not nothing for me. But uh, yeah, let's, uh, let's see our choices here. So we can go agriculture, which is good for the slaves for 20 years, but bad for population happiness. Or we go with, uh, whatever this is, greater potential in the pay day uh, basically just, yeah, conversion speed and integration happiness. I like the conversion speed. Uh, so we are going to definitely pick that because 10% conversion speed in a region that's pretty much not my religion anywhere. Look at all these barbarians. These Druic, Gaelic and Druilics. Ugh. Yeah, no, we're, we're going for that. Local citizen desire ratio, yeah, I'll, I'll survive the trauma. And that mission is done. It's another mission done. And that leaves us with either improving Rome itself some more, which I don't really like to do. It costs a lot of money, takes a lot of time. The last time we lucked out, actually. Uh, or we can do this, which I believe has to do with this territory. Actually, 
It has to do with all this territory. Not German Spear. Uh, but all of that territory as well. Well, so where's my region map? It's all this. All that territory that I don't have any of? I don't have any of it. My ally has one little thing here, but that's it. Does he have two? No, he just... does he? No, it's Macedon. Macedon. Oh, that's Macedon. Where's my ally? No, my ally doesn't have anything. My ally is in my region. He's in Caspian Paul. So, we have nothing in this area. And it does put us on a path against Macedon, which I like. It's where we're going eventually. Probably in the next stream, though. Hmm. You know, we will, um... We'll decide next time. We'll decide the goal next time. Because it is uh, now at the 4 hour mark. I think that's good for a stream. Don't you? <laughs> it's it's good enough. It's enough time. I want to thank everyone for who is uh, watching and talking in the chat here with me. There's actually a few people. A few people that I saw yesterday and the day before. Which is great. Welcome back again. Every day. <laughs> uh, those of you watching on YouTube, I do stream pretty much every day on uh, Twitch. And uh, the link is usually in the description down below. And if you like the video, of course, like, subscribe, follow me, all that fun stuff, leave comments, tell me what's good, tell me what's bad. It's all appreciated. Uh, once again, thank you very much, and have a good night.